welcome to this stream on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. That is me. I am Johnny Chiodini, for better or worse. And uh, today we're going to be playing Peglin, which um, somebody, I cannot remember who it was uh, in chat who recommended it to me. But, um, oh, it looks like a bit of me, um, to be honest with you. It is basically, what if Peggle, but you are a small goblin on an adventure? So, um... That's that's the vibe today, and I, I'm just, I warn you now, if you don't like absolutely phenomenal video game menu music, you're going to want to tune out right now, because, um, because, oh goodness me, here it comes, it's a smooth bop, hang on. This is kind of like the middle eight. This isn't even the main theme yet. I hope you can hear that. You can hear that. Good. Here it comes. This is good. Nice switch says, oh good, my theme tune made it into the game. Mm-hmm. So I've never played this before, but I spent the last ten minutes just... Just enjoying this menu music, to be honest. Not Dob, not Dob, says, took a day to recover from PAX Unplugged and I get to do it with a Johnny stream. Good choice, me. Nice. Um, I love PAX Unplugged. I haven't been in many years now. I guess 2019 was the last one I did, but oh, it's a good show. Uh, I'd like to make my way back there someday, but uh, pff, odds of that happening are so, so, so slim. Because uh, I think the only way I would be doing a PAX, probably, again, would be with Outside Xbox and Extra. But obviously, Gaming Network's up for sale, so the PAX people aren't going to be colleagues anymore. It's a whole big thing that we don't need to get into. This menu music's so good. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. Matt Wetner's done a super chat saying, We'll be watching on VOD, but can't stop laughing as that did not look like it said. Peglin on my phone when the stream went live. I know, right? Um, suffice to say, yeah, this isn't a pegging stream. Uh, if if ever if ever though I were to do a pegging stream, it would be on a very different platform. So there we go. Uh, eh, eh, way. Uh, shall we play some peglin? Let's do it. Let's be a little goblin who enjoys pachinko. Uh, let's go on an adventure. Peglin. Peglin is a jack of all trades with access to almost all orbs and relics. Flexibility and adaptability are the keys to Peglin's victory. Starting relic, Peglin Tuition. Battle rewards and chests contain an additional option to choose from. Great. There are other characters, but they haven't been unlocked yet, which is good because I only want to be Peglin. Nice which says, here we are. Streams have reached a point where I'm typing pegging stream when. Never say never, just, just saying. YouTube money's going to run out someday. Alrighty then. Dot, dot, dot. Would you like a boost? What's this? Molten gold. Battle start with five extra whatever that is. I assume that's orbs. Uh, gardener's gloves. Reduce self damage from orbs by 50%. Didn't even know I could damage myself, so that's good. Um, or pebbles. Get plus one or plus two. Suffer the sling. Let's take molten gold, shall we? Sure, let's add that relic. Let's add that relic. Um, Victorina says, hello, Johnny and LSPs. It's been a fucking two or three weeks, man. I'm ready for some snoozing to a lovely Johnny stream. Hell yeah. It has been a fucking two or three weeks, hasn't it? This year. This year. Goodness. Fuck it. All right. Oh, this so far. So slay the spire. That's a good long map, that is. Oh, look, we're going down, not up. Okay, forest floor one. Okie dokie. Never played this before. Is there a tutorial? Is there fuck? So I know that this is a turn-based game. So, right, we're this little goblin here, Peglin, up here. And then these are our enemies. And then down here, it's kind of like, it's a Peggle-adjacent Pachinko-esque game. Uh, Pebbles, level one. No idea what all this does. Uh, where's a good place to put my face? Uh, 
keep it PG-13, please. Let's put me there. There we go. Uh, because we've got an inventory here, a map, a fast forward button, and a settings button. Uh, so I guess we'll find out what's going on. Pebble, Dagorb, very weak regular attack, massive damage on crit. These are crits, I'm assuming. So we'll maybe save hitting this particular peg for when we've got that. This might be our cue. We'll see. Um, duh, 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 duh. I've got two super chats to go through, and then we'll fire off a peg. Ball, pebble. Oh dear. I shouldn't have started talking about pegging. It's one of the things they teach you in, in YouTube school. They're like, don't, don't start any stream by just coming up straight out of the gate talking about pegging. And yet here we are. Invisible Goats is on a super chat saying, Happy Monday. Outside is pretty and inside is cozy. Very happy to be watching while counting down to holidays. As always, Viddy Games. Uh, Viddy Games to you, Invisible Goats. I'm glad that you are uh, very happy to be watching and having a nice cozy time indoors. Unless you are outside in the pretty cold and looking at inwards on the cozy inside. Whatever you're doing, I hope you're having a lovely time. Uh, Minorisu has done their first ever super chat on a live stream. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. It says, hello, Johnny and Skelly's first ever live stream ever. We'll finish on VOD, but wanted to say hi. Thank you so much for joining. That is really bloody lovely. Um, I hope you're having a lovely day. Uh, Eto Perink has done a super chat saying, afternoon, Johnny and LSPs. Pegging apart, brackets, yes, when? Just popping in to say hi, and you all will be my Baldur's Gate 3 accompaniment. P.S. Love your hair, Johnny. Thank you very much. I grew up myself. I'm taking a break from Baldur's Gate 3, but I'm, I am I'm, might get into it again over the course of the festive break. Anyway, here we go. Ooh, money. Okay. Oh, that's how much damage we're doing, and they're getting closer. The dagger does very little damage as a regular attack, but it is incredibly strong on a critical hit. If you don't think you can hit a crit this turn, you can discard the dagger by using the garbage icon near the orb information on the left. Garbage day! Uh, right, we can definitely hit a crit, so that's good. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, I like this a lot already. Victorina has done a super chat uh, saying, what did Tommy Wiseau say when he tried begging for the first time? You're tearing me apart, Lisa. I hate the room, but I couldn't pass the pun up. Fair enough. Fair enough. Thank you for the super chat. That's the bluest joke I think I've ever read out uh, from a super chat. Oh, it's got to be up there anyway. Uh, up there, lol. Uh, I've never actually seen the room. Then I'm, I'm a little bit mystified by how popular it is, to be honest with you, but there we go. Um, uh, PJ Buck has done a super chat saying, we're sadly working, but shout out to... Oh no, K Kage Night Ray? Uh, yeah, Kage Night Ray for being an awesome housemate while I've been sick. BMB do crim, stay healthy. I will stay healthy. I'm only just back to full health, really, after COVID. Um, sorry you're working. Glad you're in good health. Um, and uh, thank you very much for the super chat, PJ. Let's let's crit. Oh, that is a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. Oh, they're so bond. Boom! Oh no, that was 126 on just one of the little bastards, though. Okay. Oh, we might be taking some damage up in here. Up in here. Who do I think I am? Oh, that's good. So the R means it gets you get more blocks added. So the, the goal is to hit as many blocks as possible, not necessarily to clear all the blocks. That is good to know. Okay. Do loop? Uh-oh. Oh, that didn't go the way I hoped. Okay, we've got one down, at least. But we're out of rocks. Math is my passion. Deal the exact damage needed to defeat an enemy. Okay, we're not out of rocks. I thought they might be getting a go then, but that's all right. Their go is just to advance. Understood. I love this already. I love this game. I think it is great. Cassandra Needham has done a super chat saying, no message or joke attached since I don't trust myself not to be crass. Just know I'm choosing not to say the most horrendous peg puns. Thank you very much for your forbearance, Cassandra. I'm sure they would have been absolutely wonderful. Um, oh, God. Boink. Oh, that's not huge, is it? Okay, but right, we've got the dagger, dag orb coming up now. Dag orb. There's a crit. Not great. Good enough. Should be. No, really not good enough. Oh, no. I'm going to start taking damage. Okay. 
What I might do, I tell you what I'm missing is the slight is the indicator that shows you where it's going to bounce to from the first peg, but that's all right. That's okay. I also really thought I was going to struggle with the lack of Beethoven in this uh, this video game, but the music absolutely kicks ass. So we're fine, really. Come on, now that, that should be fine. Okay. Oh Christ. Okay, we're in a bit of trouble. Oh no! I don't know if we are. Uh, yes, we are. We're going to take some damage. Oh, I took three damage. Oh, three more damage. Okay, I think that's all right. That's okay. Chris Rakowski has done a super chat saying, Can you please say hi to my lovely... Sorry, this bass line. This game is fucking great. And it's in early access. This isn't even the final version. Sorry, Chris Rakowski has done a super chat saying, Can you please say hi to my lovely wife, Lizzie, who is both very pregnant and unfortunately got a cold. Also, thank you for a wonderful afternoon stream. You're very welcome. Hello, Lizzie. I hear you are very pignat. Um, Congratulations. Uh, I hope the... I, I'm going to assume it's the third trimester if you're very pignat, uh, is is treating you relatively okay, that your fatigue levels aren't, aren't too bad. Uh, and obviously, I wish you a very uh, safe and smooth and happy delivery. Um, I'm sorry you've got a cold. Let's um, let's hope that clears up right soon. Um, and yeah, just congrats on the impending arrival to both of you. And thanks for the super chat, Chris. Uh, Blue Book of Secrets has done a super chat saying, I'm addicted to this game. I'm playing along with you. You got this, Johnny. All right, Blue Book of Secrets. Thank you very much. Um, I, yeah, I'm, I'm loving this already. I've not even f passed the first level, which, uh, frankly, that sounds like I'm thrill house playing fucking uh, Bone Storm, but and that was not a great go. But it was enough. Okay, what we need to do, ideally, is hit that little little green R thing to get more potential damage output. Come on! Yes! Well, you know what? We'll take it. We'll take it. We're going to take some damage. But that wasn't too bad, I like to think. Oh, I've got some money. Oh, come on. A bit more... Mo yeah, okay. Oh, what does the bomb do? We've lit the bomb, seemingly. Ow, you little bastard. Oh, that was a shit one, wasn't it? Oh, it was okay. All right, we got this. We're fine. We're clear. The level is good. Ta-da! Rewards! Uh, let's see. Twoo's, Twoo's Company. Uh, how much money do I have? I got 67 coins that I got from that. Um... Nice, which says, welcome, Thrill Ho. I told my friend... The game audio a bit low, so hard to tell if music is nice or not. Well, there's no music playing right now. If I... This is actually a good time to test this. If I turn the game up, game audio up to that, have you got much of a hiss going on right now? I'll shut up. Is there big hiss going on right now? Yes, you'll never land when I need you. Um, I told my friend who's got... Um, a Simpsons tattoo already that Thrill Ho fits perfectly on Knuckles, and she's genuinely thinking about it, which makes me very happy. Invisible Goat said, no, nah, no hiss on my end. Hiss, you're never around when I need you. Right, rewards. Twoo's company. Pegs are hit when an orb makes contact with them. Blah, blah, blah. Applies double damage slime to every nine pegs hit. Okay, that sounds great, in fairness. Ballad. Grants one spiness after attacking. Spiness grants all orbs plus zero slash plus X. No idea. Memorb. Memorb. Deals an additional 0.34 damage for each peg hit this battle. Can target any enemy. Can only be used once per battle. Uh, spinfectious Sting. Applies Spinfection 1 under critical hit. Applies an additional Spinfection 2. Each turn, enemies with Spinfection X lose 10 asterisk X HP. I'm going to buy Two's Company. Are these orbs that are going to go into rotation? I hope so, because I'm going to buy Spinfectious Sting as well. I'm not going to upgrade an orb, and I'm not going to heal. Take that. X, Y is normal hits damage versus crits damage. Thank you, Mals. Right, okay. Onwards. Oh, what are we doing now? <gasps> is that a chest? Oh. <laughs> I wasn't sure what I was doing there. Oh, well. Oh, I was picking my route. Okay, there we go. All right, here we go. Take a relic. Spiral Slayer. Uh, start each battle with one Mew Circle. Mew Circle grants all orbs plus X 
Uh, so plus one damage, plus zero crit. Or Dumbbell. <laughs> Every reload grants plus two muse mu circle. I'm going to take the, the Dumbbell. Oh, I'm really, really enjoying this. Look at me. Look at my little head bouncing around. Look at my bunts. My bouncy, bouncy bunts. Oh, skull seems bad. Oh, no, it's fight. Again, I'm picking a route. It's all right, Johnny. You can chill. You can chill out. Oh, this is fucking great. Okay, now we got Twoo's company, which is a good time to have this one because hopefully we'll hit at least nine pegs. Two, three, four, five, six, six. Fuck. Okay, well, that's all right. Here's a pebble. Oh, yeah, how's the music level now? Sorry, that was the whole... I was going to ask that. Oh, I feel like I could play this for days, frankly. Crete! Crete! Yeah, get fucked, little slime bastard. Uh, there's another crit, and we've got a dag orb. So let's lob that. This is just one of those games where they made a perfectly viable product and then went, what should we do about the music? Shall we make it slap unfeasibly hard? And someone went, yeah, all right. Absolutely incredible. Oh, Mel says must, must circle is more muscle than music, I think. That makes a lot of sense. But there is also a ball orb, which is like a ballad orb. Invisible Goat says, this is the kind of music I put on to tidy. Jams to be a tiny creature going about tasks to. That sounds amazing. What did the what bomb for? Oh, right. Oh! Oh, that's clever. When you throw a bomb, but hitting additional pegs determines how far it goes. That was a shit turn. I must reload. Oh, fuck. Do you think jazz musicians injure their necks in the same way like headbangers do, but just by like doing that? I can believe it. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Fuck. Okay, that one's dead. I've been. We've been better. Okay, reload. There we go. There we go. Oh, fucking crit. Yes, you're dead, you little bastard. Ma, 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 ma. Freem. Oh, oh, right. What we got now? Oh, here we go. Here's the ballad, 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 ballad orb. Uh, splat orb applies rubber slime to every five pegs hit. Rubber slimed are rubber slimed pegs are extra bouncy and are durable. <laughs> no, no. A meg orb downgrades each peg it, it hits with minus one damage. Oh, overflow causes excess damage to carry over to the next enemy. Well, yes, I think we'll be buying that one. And then should we up should we upgrade an orb? Um. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's upgrade the dag orb. And then we can't afford anything else, so let's continue. <clears throat> this is fun. Okay, let's not go into the fire. Cast it into the fire. Let's just go that way. I like the little run-up he takes. <laughs> Okie dokie. You encounter a weathered old peglin flipping a poker chip through their nimble fingers. Do you consider yourself a gambler? Flip the chip. Either lose two health or gain a relic. Invest with gambling or leave. Should we invest? No, we haven't got any money. Let's flip the chip. Fuck it. Bottom slut. Bottom sluts. <laughs> Gain multipliers that double or halve your shot damage. All right. You win the flip. The other pegling gives you a rice smile and hands over the chip. Thanks for playing. Can't wait till next time. Well, that went brilliantly. Bombs hit all enemies for 50. Right, okay. 
Look, come on. Do you really... You can't expect me to read out bottom slots after the amount of chat we've already had and not giggle. Come on. Oh, that was awful, that one. Come on. Yes, 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 yes. No. In the woods, you find a clearing with a strange tree directly in the center. There is a nook in the trunk with brambles twisting wildly out of it. Reach into the, the nook to lose 10 HP. Shake the tree or continue. Let's shake the tree. You shake the tree with all your might and from somewhere high in the boughs, an egg shakes loose. You are able to save it by catching it in your satchel. We've got an egg. Now, it doesn't matter which way we go from here. We'll be able to visit gamespot.com after that, so really, oops. Uh, close the map. Let's just let fate decide, or physics rather. Let's have a fight. I was kind of hoping we'd have a fight, to be honest with you. Oh, what are these? Oh, they're like, um, they're attacky flowers. I thought they were snacks, but they're not. That's okay. Egg. Heals you for each peg hit. Permanently breaks when hitting something solid on the pegboard. Alright. Well, it, it healed me. I'm not sure I should have. Oh, well. Oh, yes! Overflow damage! Oh. Oh, it returned my da- Oh, no! They've got range! Shit! Okay, don't panic, anyone. Double damage. You got slimed, baby. All right. It's just so fucking good. Um, where's a crit slot? Damn it. I was trying to surf it down there to get a crit. Crit, 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 crit. Bastard. Five damage. The dag orb really is a feast or famine kind of weapon. Ow! I'm getting hoit. Mm -mm, not good. Not good at all. That's a bit better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hit the bomb. Hit the bomb. I dare you. Okay, crit's fine. Crit doubled is great. Complete overkill there. Okay. What's this one again? Twoo's Company applies double damage slime to every nine pegs hit. All right, well, let's just hope this goes goes the distance. Nope. But, oh, fuck. I'm a little nervous all of a sudden. Oh, you can choose who you target, look. Well, that's handy. Let's crit this little bastard. Yeah, that thing's dead now. Lovely. Oh, or is it 0 0.5? Oh, no, wait, that didn't didn't change who I targeted. Oh, well, it's fine. Okay, we've reloaded. Now we've got the Spinfectious Sting. Jatwa says, hello. Hello, how are you? I hope you're well. Welcome aboard. This is Peglin. It's where you're a little goblin who's kind of playing with pegs. It's like Peggle, Peggle Goblin, but in a non-litigious fashion. I'm not sure. Oh my god, that was friendly fire. The plants just wasted that slime for me. Great. Let's get a crit going. Come on, let's hit lots of pegs on this one. Yes, please. That's delightful. Hmm. Okay, no, that was pretty great. Oh, the bomb does hit everyone for 50. Okay, great. You're also knowledgeable. It's great. Okay, this one's got overflow. I'd love a cheeky reload, actually. So let's get that. Probably not the best orb I could have used for that. Ooh, we don't hate it, though. Okay, again, no. Nah. Uh, James Malcolmson has done a super chat saying breakfast with a bonus Kiadini stream. Best way to start the new week. 
A very good morning to you. I hope you're having a nutritious and delicious breakfast. Uh, yes, I am a little goblin and I have destroyed all of the plants. I would like to heal. Oh, I'm half dead. God, life catches up with you quick, doesn't it? One minute you're you're a little you're a little goblin setting out on a quest, making some crude jokes. The next minute you're close to dying. Okie dokie. Let's go to GameSpot.com and work out why that it's in here. Hello, Mr. Tom for the win. Mr. Tom for the win says, hello there, you bunch of troublemakers. Hi. Oh, it's a shop. Bollocks. Well, I've got no money, so sorry to be rude, but goodbye. Oh, all the sounds are very pleasing. <gasps> nice which says guess whose birthday it is on Sunday bracket spoilers it's mine the slime bastards heal two every time the board is refreshed yes I think we'll be taking a cookie um, happy birthday for Sunday what you got planned my good pal I hope you are going to oh shit have a lovely time I hope it enjoys enjoys I hope it involves uh, fun and presents possibly a bift who knows Right. Nice which says, I'm gonna eat so much food. What you gonna have? Where you gonna go? Oh, that was lucky. Get fucked, bat. Um, let's see. Dag orb. Where's a crit? You know what? Let's bin off the dag orb. Let's not bother with that for now. Especially with a shot like that. Oh no! Ow, I hurt myself. Crit. Oh, don't bounce all the way out. Oh, thank God. No, not 0 0.5. I needed you to do loads of damage. Not almost no of damage. Okay. This is better. This is a lot better. Come on, let's have a bomb. Yes. Oh, they're all so fucked. This might be an instant clear, you know. Especially with numbers like that. That final shot was 298 damage. Okay, what we got here? Neck neck orb mancer. Can only hit bombs. Hit hit pegs are refresh back to rah. Can target any enemy. Upgrades each hit. Ooh, that sounds like cool. Morbid orb. Morbid orb. Mor morbid allows orbs to activate. Yeah, okay. Here's the ballad. And then in instigate orb. Very good. The next orb fired will attack all enemies. That does sound good. We should really heal, but I'm kind of just so intrigued by the neck orb mancer. Fuck it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Why not? Uh, Daniel Trigg has done a super chat saying, my D&D players just made it to the pirate islands and ended up meeting Captain Johnny of the Salty Pig, who's who's a walking thank you to the Oxventure. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you so much, Daniel. Um... I hope that they are having a bloody lovely time, and more importantly, that you are having a bloody lovely time running the game for them. I don't want it to be a chore, I want it to be a joy for you. So, fingers crossed, you're having a nice, nice time. And again, thank you, oh shit, very much for a very kind inclusion. Okay, we're off to the shop. Hollis Wood says, you need to heal though. Yeah, I do. But sometimes you just gotta buy the necro necrobulb. Reorganizer? Hmm. No, I'm going to save my money. Hopefully I'll live through the next um, encounter. And then we can heal at the end of that. Ring of Indignation. Whenever you lose health, deal twice that amount to all enemies. Yes, I think I'll be taking that. Yes. Ring of Indignation. Fantastic. Uh, Krinspec Vander says, I arrived. Did I arrive late or early? Who could possibly let me know? I can let you know, Krin, and I'm telling you, you have arrived neither late nor early. You have arrived precisely when you mean to. So there. Oh, hello. What's all this then? <laughs> Shut up, Johnny. All right. 
Oh god, it's all slam. It's all slammed. Oh, it's a big slime, look. We must infiltrate the heart of the slime. Fuck off the dagger orb at this point. That's what we need to do. Go on, hit the bombs, hit the bombs, hit the bombs. Yes, that's good. 140 damage. Yes, we'll take a few more like that, please. Ew. Yes, yes. Crit, yes. And then double critted. <laughs> oh, it's, it's going to be so bad when that thing reaches me. But you know what? Hopefully we'll be okay. Oh, I could really do with a reload, actually. There's a couple. They're not that accessible. Oh, no, I've gone from feeling very confident in the span of seconds to feeling very, not very confident. But the music continues to absolutely tear shit up. Oh, Christ, it's the fucking Necrorb. Okay. <laughs> I didn't hate that. Oh, it's going to swallow me alive or something, isn't it? What have we got now? Okay, the Spinfection one. Come on, reload, 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 please. Fuck! Oh, that's bad. We've been at. It's been. It's at us. It's at us. It's at us. <laughs> mm hmm. Lovely. Okay, great. Oh, look. Yes! Reload me. Uh, I don't think we're going to make it through this. I'll be perfectly honest with you. Oh, you never know, actually. Come on. Crit, 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 crit. Fuck. No, that's not enough. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Come on. Yes! Oh, shit. No! Oh, that was close. That was very close. Holy shit. <laughs> Chopping Balok. Apply shield to every five hit. Nah, nah, nah. Do a plus two damage to each shit. Spiky on the ball. Colin Lasser says, holy balls, that was lucky. I think you mean skillful. Ball lightning zaps an additional peg nearby every... Uh, Nearby peg, every bounce can target any enemy. Critical hit attacks all enemies in targeted column. We're absolutely buying ball lightning. And you know what? We'll get the chopping ballock as well. Christ alive. Let's upgrade something as well. Should we upgrade just one of the pebbles? Sure, why not? Take relic. The board will contain ten additional refresh, but each refresh only refreshes four. No. Sealed Conviction. All attacks get plus two, plus two, but you have minus one orb discards. That's pretty great. Each three pegs hit provides explosive force until the board is refreshed. Or Glorious Suffer Ring. No, let's take the Sealed Conviction. Mr. Tom for the win says I'm going to have to play this. It's so good. But Tom also says, but mind you, I've only just bought Lethal Company, so I'll have to wait. I haven't played Lethal Company yet. My partner fucking loves it. But I've, uh, yeah, I've not given it a go. Forest, complete. Ah, you can thin your deck at the shop to get rid of all the pebbles. Thank you, call me mug. Oh, this is a nice map, isn't it? It's quite Castlevania. Not Castlevania. Castle Wolfenstein. Here we go. Oh, little nightmen. Oh, they've got shields. Oh, that's worrying. But here comes a necrorb. It's hit a bomb. And it's done fuck all. That sucked. Here's Twoo's company. Oh, don't use all of the reloads, though. Hey, how about, how about, yeah, be careful. I mean, this should be interesting. Yeah, all right. Ugh, the shield. Call me, call me Mug says, these guys are knobs. Understood. Good to know. Oh, the shield icons are just like bouncy pegs that sort of keep the ball in rotation. And I understand. Okay. Oh, this feels nice. Go on. Yes, and in the plus two. 
216 damage on that one. Don't hate it. This game's fucking magic. I don't know who it was who suggested it. I'll have to go back and look at the stream to find out, but... Lovely. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo. Come on, then. Brave Sir Knight. Go on, hit the crit. Yes! Good lord. He lives. Now, which one's this? The Chopping Balak, of course. How could I forget? Let's pop it right in the middle of these two, shall we? Boop. Okay, well, I only hit one, but that's all right. Oh, no! Not the not for fuck. Damn it. Dum dum. Dum dum. Okay, that should do it. Oh, I love this. I love this. Susceptible. Every two crits hit, you'll apply one exploitable. <laughs> God. <laughs> uh, Infern orb. Lighter than other orbs. Detonates or, uh, bombs in one hit. Destroys shields in one hit. Deals two self-damage when fired. Uh, what's this one? Toil and trouble. Very good. Applies spin infection on a crit. Applies an additional spin infection too. Can target any enemy. Guz damage does good damage as well. Let's get the uh, toil and trouble. <sighs> All righty. Oh, I'm gonna have a little stretch. When was the last time you had a stretch? Hey, should we have a little stretch, shall we? Because, oh, in the UK it's getting colder, which means people don't move around as much, which means you can get a little stiff, which makes it less appealing to move around. Just saying. Oh, hello. This one's going to be interesting. This route. You find yourself looking at two identical altars, each with a perfect location to place an orb. Place an orb on an altar and duplicate an orb. I'd love to. What should we duplicate? Let's duplicate toil and trouble, frankly, I think. Yeah, let's do it. Duplicate. Uh, la 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 la. Great. Well, that was very useful. Thanks. This is so good. I love it. Yep, keep it going. Keep it going. Oh, these things have a shit ton of... Shit ton of health. Look at that. Well, that one does... Oh, my God! They move faster than you'd think as well. Okay, this is just a normal pebble. So we'd like it to hit as much as physically possible, really. Really get the damage out there. Cheeky reload doesn't hurt. Do not go down the 0.5. Great. Not bad from a pebble. Oh, fuck. This is bad. Emma Benton. Hello. Um, Emma Benton says, I tuned in just in time to hear Johnny talk about moving when it's cold. And as someone whose hips have been staging a revolt due to the cold, I feel attacked. So thank you for that. Sorry. <laughs> also, hello, Emma. I hope you're well. Apart from your hips staging a revolt. I found a ball lightning. These orbs can pop additional pegs with chain lightning. They can also attack any enemy you target on the screen. To target an enemy, click on them. You'll see a targeting reticle appear. Ball lightning is one of the best ways to deal with pesky ranged en enemies. Got it. So we'll, let's target that one for shits and grins. Why not? Um, anyway, yeah, welcome aboard, Emma. It's been a lot of talk of pegging so far uh, in the stream. Sorry about it. Oh, no. 0.5. But that worked. Ooh. <laughs> I did 69 damage. Nice, etc. Where's a crit? You know what? We're unlikely to get a crit. Oh, we don't have a, a discard, so never mind. 
Call Me Mug says, as much as I as watching you play this is great, Johnny, it is just made me absolutely desperate for my Peglin fix. Hey, I do not blame you. This game is incredible, turns out. On a critical hit, flies right. Let's get a reload. Can I get a reload? So, um, how about Craig David saying that uh, he can see into the future? Didn't have that on my bingo card for this week. 0.5 blocks. Now I'm getting beaten up by some blocks. Minute Ellis on the Super Chat saying, God, it's been absolutely ages since I've caught a live stream. This game seems like one I'll probably end up getting once it's available. Oh, hell yeah. It's great. Oh, are some of you not across the fact that, that pop singer Craig David says that he can see into the future? Yep. It's apparently just a thing he can he can do now, which is which is good. Give it a Google. It's, I did not expect him to say it, but he's, he's bloody well said it, so... And who am I to say that's not likely? Oh, please don't go down the 0.5. I mean, even so, you're going to do loads of damage, but... Bollocks. Oh, but you're going to do it all to that... Oh, no, thank God. Oh! Okay, that went pretty well. Okie dokie. Uh, sit, 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 kai. Multi-ball? Multi-ball calls orbs to split into two when hitting a peg. Each additional level allows, allows multi-ball to split an additional time. Lovely. Another ball lightning. Mm. Protect orb. Grants ball walk three. <laughs> let's get the... Let's get this guy. Um, and let's heal. I think that would be worthwhile. Uh, Brandon Hart has done a super chat saying, Hey Johnny and LSP, so have I missed any good puns yet? Um, oh gosh, Brandon. There's, mm. I mean, A... As Kira Cox says, this game is entirely puns. Um, but also, yeah, there have been quite a few somewhat blue puns, shall we say. Anyway, the super chat continues with stay hydrated and stay warm all. Love to you all from Minnesota, which is still somewhat warm for the time of year. Oh, uh, well, yeah, lots of love to you over in Minnesota. And you also stay hydrated and warm. Um, I've had to really watch my hydration this week, actually, because my... One of my kidneys has been just sore, which is a fun, fun thing to have happen. But um, I've been I've been taking care of it um, and staying hydrated and laying off the caffeine and and fun alcoholic drinks. Well, this is different. We're apparently fighting two coat racks with incredible amounts of energy. We've got two fucking ranged bastards. Oh, these are like barricades. Well, that's no good. Right, let's crit that. Come on. Yeah, lots and lots of... No, fucking don't go in the... No point bastard. Okay. You ranged shitbags. This is a pebble. Just hit lots and lots of... Okay, well, fuck you. Rubbish. I'm not sure about the necromantic orb or whatever it's called. No! Oh. oh, God. That was interesting. Right, archers really shouldn't be getting that close, should they? I mean, I'm no, I'm no warrior, but... I just don't think what they're doing is tactically sound, but since it benefits me, I guess I'll keep my mouth shut. That's more like it. Get fucked. Ball lightning. Here we go. That's more fucking like it. Don't go down the 0.5. Your shit bag. Thank you. Uh, that was okay, mostly. Now, what's this one? Ah, yeah. Multi-ball. Okay. Don't hate it. Yeah. No, no, no. Yes. Oh, I actually enjoyed it very much. <laughs> Dag orb. Let's get that crit. Fuck, I missed that crit. There we go. We got that crit. Don't go down that fuck. Good lord. It's It's real edgy your seat stuff. If I say so myself. I know this is my stream, so I shouldn't really be praising it in any way, shape, or form. If anything, I should be apologising. But, uh, no! 
But the random element is just mwah, delicious. Garbage day says, I think the correct f phrase for this term is, sorry, I think the correct phrase for this game is get pegged. Garbage day. Um, you're probably right. But yeah, let's adopt that. Get pegged. There you go. Fuck. This is I who got pegged then. Right, reload. Desperately needed a reload there. What ball is this? Oh, it's the toil and trouble. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't. Don't. Just don't. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, <laughs> Bomb. And... Just a tremendous amount of damage, but halved, which is less fun. Oh, very much enjoying this. Uh, Paul Harrower says, why are some of the holes on fire? Uh, basically, if the ball goes down that, I take damage. Is this an added, added element of risk? There you go, I took two damage there. Chopping Balog. Like chopping block, but it sounds to me more like bollock. There, I said it. Sorry to be crass. Okay, I'm down to 66 health. I'm gonna heal up. Loath as I am. Swaltorb upgrades each peg hit plus one damage. Okay, we don't hate that. Splatorb. Uh... Well, let's, ooh, what it is? Electorb, electorb magic. Electorb magnet. Still, I mean, I'm most, I'm mostly back to normal post COVID. But there's still a little bit of struggling to connect mouth with brain. That's been, it's made me very uh, susceptible to spoonerisms. I'm not gonna lie, uh, the last couple of weeks. But electorb magnet, in my defence, is not the easiest thing to say. Strong attraction to reload and. Uh, 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 crits. Effect is full strength of three seconds and decreases over the next six seconds. Oh, well, they'll take, well, let's take that. Bit of fun. Let's try something different. All right. Let's keep going. So if you're just joining me, this is um, Peglin. Uh, it's kind of like Peggle, but you're a goblin. So I'm this little green goblin up here going on an adventure. And I make my attacks and advance myself by firing orbs at pegs. It, it's it's fucking great. We've avoided a big boss there, which I think is useful. Okay. We're fighting knights, and look, the board is in the shape of one. Here comes the dag orb, which gets massive damage on a crit, so let's just do that straight off the bat. Yes, that was a decent amount of damage. I erased his shield completely. Uh, let's see. What have we got? Oh, the Elector Magnet. Yeah, sure. I oh, hit two reloads. Oh my god, it really does have a strong attraction, doesn't it? Look at you! Okay, alright, decent. Well, Auden the MB says, uh, thank you for the explanation, Johnny. You're very, very welcome. Uh, I very much have a policy of not punishing people for uh, tuning in partway through a stream. So it would be weird if I refused to explain a game for those who uh, who didn't catch the very start. Ooh. Dylan Long says, anyone know of any good video game spoonerisms? All I have is douse of the head. Very good. Um, oh gosh, I'm struggling now. I'm not sure. Whoop, that was a fun little, which orb is this? Oh, it's Tools Company. <gasps> it applied double damage slime. That was a shit go though. Okay, which one's this? <gasps> Multiball. Yes, let's, don't be, don't be a shit go though. Let's, I was going to say, let's crit a, a multi-ball. Absolutely. Okay, that's more like it. All right. Great. Ooh, let's start taking some chunks. Some lumps, rather. A mega orb. Right, overflow. So that's useful. Let's get a cheeky reload. Oh, 
come on. Yeah, all right. Yes! Very nice. That's what we wanted. We wanted a high damage on that one. Here comes ball lightning. Oh, ball lightning, please. Issy Mary says, trains are getting cancelled like it's nobody's business. Guess, guess I'll hang out here and pretend it's not my problem, even though it really is. Oofed. Um, I hope it all gets sorted soon. Train cancellations can be some of the most demoralising things. I remember there was one time in particular when I was in Brighton, when I was still at Eurogo Mac, and the trains were, were fucked. Um, and so we had no option. We had, well, you know, we could. I suppose we could have gone anywhere, but we were like, well, let's just go to the pub. And uh, we ended up having dinner in the pub, and I like, had a few pints in the pub, and I was sat there talking to, like, you know, Ian Higton and Ollie Welsh, who was editor in chief at the time. And I remember sitting there thinking, if I were here by choice, I would be having the time of my life. But we were all just sat there, like, like the train's running yet. Yeah. Just all of us, like, slightly perturbed to be in, in the pub having a nice chat. It, re it was really weird. Just the, the, the uncertainty underpinning all of it made it really difficult to just cut loose and have a nice time. It's very odd. Uh, Reorganizer. Shuffle the reload and crit pegs every five pegs. Hit up to ten times. Shuffle la, 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 when it's discarded. Cauldron bubble. Uh, ba -da, ba -da. Attacks all enemies. Applies spin faction one on a crit. It applies an additional one. Not dreadful. All orb nothing. Weak regular damage that cannot be modified. Massive damage on crit. That's going to wind me up if I get that. Double, double. Doubles the amount of spin faction on the enemy. Can target any enemy. Eh. I think let's get the cauldron one. There we go. Uh, and then let's go straight to... Don't, don't go in the flame pit, please. Please. Thank you. You stumble onto a strange mirror with shadows flickering in the reflection. You're drawn closer and closer until your nose is nearly touching the glass. The shadows are speaking a language you've never heard before, but you understand their offer. We could duplicate all orbs and lose 4 HP, or duplicate a random orb and lose 8 HP. Why would I choose to just duplicate a random orb and take double damage? I suppose if I could choose the orb, I'd, I'd do this. Let's duplicate them all. Fuck it. You feel a large transfer of energy from the mirror and all of your orbs have been duplicated. Okay. Oh, look, it's mirroring. It's mirroring, look. Hmm. Cassandra, Need Cassandra Needham says larger satchels can cause their own problems. Yeah, fair. Take Relic. Adventurine. The first peg hit by each orb gets plus 10 damage. Basalt Totem. Basalt Totem. Oh, Basalt Totem. Right. I was like, where's the pun there? Post battle upgrading now includes the option to increase your max HP by 4 plus. That sounds pretty good. That sounds good as well. Let's take this one. Doesn't matter which one, so let's just... Whoop! Alright, we're going that way. Ooh, the shop's coming up. Okay, you big bastard blocks. Have some ball lightning, courtesy of me, a peglin. Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's the worst. Ah, oh, for it to hit the 0 0.5 and do me damage, that sucked. <laughs> Emma Benton quite rightly says, what fresh hell is this? I couldn't agree more, Emma. It is uh, troubling. Okay. Yeah, decent damage on that one. Ow! What we got? Cauldron Bubble. Yes, I'm, I'm excited about this one. A crit would be great. There's a crit. 
Oh, come on. Hit a lot of pegs, please. And then go down a... Yes! Fucking great. Big fan of that. And then this is the chopping block, Balok. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't hate it. Ow. Ow. You bastards. Okay. Great. Love that for us. Decent damage. Fuck, no! I fucked it. I cursed myself. Jinxed it. Ugh. Elector Magnet. Come on. Yes, crit. Crit, crit, crit. Great. Lovely. Just the one left, so we should survive the fight at least. Oh. The sheer amount of moving on this one not my favourite. Ow. You bastard. Create. Reload. Hit lots of peg. Don't. Thank you. 576 damage there at the end. Don't hate that. Okay. We need to heal. And let's increase our max HP. Why not? No, we can't. Yes, we can. We can afford it. There we go. What was this? Extra ordinary. Very good. Weak crit damage that cannot be modified. Ah, right. Okay. Oh no, we spent all our money and now we have to go to the shop. Let's try and earn a bit more money. Great, we've got one extra coin, everyone. <laughs> oh, this shopkeeper must think I'm a real deadbeat. Hello, I can't afford anything. Goodbye. Alright, here we go. Oof, 600 health knights. But look at this pegboard. I'm slightly worried about the two 0.5s. Especially since on this go, they're right in the middle. Go that way. Go that way. Yeah, 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 fucking yes. Oh, we're fighting a big wall that's got 7,000 health. And is eating its own? Well, that's worrying, isn't it? Okay, so this can only hit... Booms. Oh, dear. My cat is typing this says you did not need to heal for this boss. Did I not? Emma ah, says it's the wall of sand from the mummy. <laughs> Who knew that being a little peg peggle goblin would put me up against such hideous foes? Oh, yes, please. Please don't go down the 0.5. We're doing such lovely damage. Fuck. 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 Whoa. 776. Yum, yum, yum. Ah, oh, Pad Hawthorne says, God, it's been so long since I could catch a stream. Glad to be back. Glad to have you back. How you doing, Pad? I hope you're very well. Peglin is great. You heard it here first. Maybe. Some of you were already aware of this game. I'll be honest. Oh, shit! Absolutely sensational. Nice switch says everyone in the mummy was so hot, including giant sandstorm version of Imhotep. Preach. Just facts. Yeah, that game. That game? That film. It was an awakening in a lot of people. Lot of people. You know how like there used to be fan clubs in um, like magazines and stuff. You could write in and join like you know the take that fan club or whatever. There should absolutely be an old school write in with a stamped address envelope fan club for people who had a bisexual awakening watching The Mummy, starring Brendan Fraser, and um, oh god, what's her first name? Uh, Rachel Vice. I actually. Um, 
fancies the pants off our death. Our debt pay. Especially in the second one. Um, although I don't actually consider myself to be bi, but uh, a lot of my early screen crushes were on men. It's weird. Um, a slightly embarrassing one is uh, Kiefer Sutherland in The Three Musketeers. Ding dong. I don't know whether it was like an aspirational thing of like, you know, I thought that they were cool mask characters and I wanted to kind of be like them. There was definitely a little feelings thing for them uh, as well. So, who knows? You know? Sexuality is confusing. Hollisford says gender envy, maybe? I don't think so. Maybe? Maybe? I don't know. Because, but then I, you know, discovered I'm non-binary later in life. I don't know what little me was um, was thinking about. Yeah, pour the soup on Imhotep. We've still got 4,000 health to chew through here. Okay, let's try and get... Oh, God. What are we going to try and get? Let's try and get a crit in here. Yep, okay, great. Yeah! Reload's nice, isn't it? Yes, great, good. Paul Harrower says, Wall look big sad. Wall look big sad, yeah. But that's because Anaxa Namoon is, is currently still in in the afterlife. Uh, when, you know, in Wall's, Wall's, feel, in Wall's estimation, they were destined to be together, you know? Hard, difficult, difficult to live like that. I'm just a wall. Where's my girlfriend? She's in the afterlife. And I've gone to all this trouble to try and bring her back. And it turns out that some absolute nerd from England can undo all of that by just saying Kadishmal, Kadishmal, Paradus, Paradus, and then bang, I'm mortal again. I know, like, death is only the beginning and all that, but it's, it's tricky to be a wall in a long-distance relationship. Just saying. CookieCat94 has done a super chat saying, if that, if a square peg that wanders if it could plug a round... Wait, if a square peg wanders if it could plug a round hole, does that make it Picurious? Oh, I see. Pi yeah, squares. Wow. If a square peg that wonders if it can plug a round hole, does that make it pie curious? Very good. Anonymous says, I'm a Sam Wall Mister! Go on, get it, yeah. Get it. Fuck it up. Please don't go down the not point. Oh god, oh god, where's it going now? Oh shit. Oop! Oh, we certainly don't hate it. We hate the. Yep, the down, down that one is fine by me. That's a lot of bombs. Reese says, D Keo Discord Mummy, watch along when. Ooh. It's a very, very good good question. Let's let's maybe that'll be a, a nice holiday treat for all of us. The only problem, right, is um, getting the same versions to line up because um, for some reason, we had this when, at the very start of the channel, we watched Starship Troopers all together. Um, I think the one of the versions is 24 frames a second, one of them is 25 frames a second, which doesn't sound like much, but it means that every 24 seconds you get a second out of sync, so very, very quickly the, the film starts to drift. Um, so we'll need to try and work out a version that everyone can watch and will still be in... in in time with, but oh, a hundred percent. Let's do it. Let's do it. Fuck it. I've been wanting to sort of revitalize some old ideas for the channel and come up with some new stuff, etc., etc. Um, yeah, let's just fucking watch. Paul Harrow says we can use cast. Oh, interesting. Okay.
Uh, yeah, all right, great. I'll, uh, well, yeah, let's, I'll, I'll have a good look into it, and then let's just make it happen. Why not? Ah, dead pay. Look now. That's from The Mummy Returns, though. So. God, I bloody love The Mummy. It's great. Although, man, so I watched it a couple of years ago with some friends. And, uh, God, John Hanna in particular, not nice about, oh, no. Oh, I got et. Oh, I got et. Oh, it, oh, it et me, et me. Right, that's why I didn't need to heal for that one, because if it wasn't dead, I'd just die. Right, I get it. Oh, well. Uh, that was a good first run. I don't hate it. Um, oh, God, they're not nice about homage to Lily's character at all. They just, every time they talk about him, they're like, ah, oh, smelly, horrible friend who smells. It's, um... It's the one thing that sticks out to me now. It's like, wow, can we stop banging on about homage to Lily in that way, please? Anyway, we got eaten by Emotep. Um, Lance Roberts is on Super Chat saying, uh, haven't been in a good headspace the last few months. Binging your content has been massively helpful. You are absolutely amazing. I know this isn't much of an appreciation. I just wanted you to know. Thanks for everything. That's a wonderful appreciation, Lance. Thank you very, very much. Firstly, it's, it's very generous. Um, and secondly... Um, I'm sorry that you've been having a rough time and that uh, watching me being a silly little weirdo on the internet has has proved useful. Um, I really hope things start looking up for you soon. I, it feels like most of the people I know are having a hard time at the minute. Myself included, to be honest. This year's been shit. <laughs> um, so... Yeah, but I, I, do, I do hope things start looking up soon. And again, thank you very much for some very kind words and for the generous super chat. Zega Genesis says, He runs a prison and blackmails women for sex. He's a bastard. I'm not saying he's a sympathetic character, but... Like... I don't know, this is... It's it's the, the, the things they say and the jokes they make. It's like, they're... They're punching down in a way they don't need to be, you know. Like it just it just stood out to me a little bit. Um, but there we go. Uh, oh, apparently that was a decent first run. Okay, great, cool, good. Well, let's go again, shall we? Pegline. Win a battle after inflicting 50 plus spinfection on any enemy to unlock this class. In a single shot, bounce an orb on at least six slimed pegs in a row to unlock this one. Uh, win a battle with at least 100 bulwark remaining to unlock this class. Alright, well, we're not unlocking any of those just yet, so. Let's be Peglin! Mrs. Hon for the Wind says, I've technically had a year with some real bright spots, but everything else has made me feel like absolute shite. That's the thing. It's like, at the minute, I think it's lovely, and I'm not I'm not doing it down at all. I think it's wonderful. There's a, a thread going, uh, there's a tweet going around on Twitter that's like, retweet this, bragging about something you feel good about doing in 2023. And every time I see it, like, I just keep thinking, while well, I'm alive, like, I, I've survived almost the whole year. You know, and I think there are some bright spots in there. I think, you know, it's it, in many ways it's been an exciting year where I've done some things I should be proud of, but I'm damned if I can think about them. You know, it's a weird one. Um, but yeah, so solidarity to anyone who's been having a bit of a shit a year. Right, would you like a boost? Super boots, heal one for every peg hit while successfully navigating after a battle and take no damage from misnavigation. I don't really know what navigation or misnavigation is, but that's fine. Uh, sand arrows. Attacks apply blind four to enemies. Blind enemies have an X percent chance to hit when... Nah. Uh, adventuring. Let's take the super boots. Super boots. My cat is typing this. It's on a super chat saying... Oh. Oh, bloody hell. Um, my cat is typing this as... I have lost the cat that was typing this three weeks ago and a week later fell from my bike, breaking, bruising and concussing. It wasn't the best November for me either. Also, Dutch and left wing. Bloody hell. Yeah, that's a, that's a laundry list. I'm so sorry my cat is typing this. Um, I do hope you, you heal up very, very soon. Um, that sounds... Yeah, November sounds absolutely bloody shit. And I'm sorry that things existentially are also difficult. Um, 
Lots of love to you, and I hope things start looking up very, very soon. Aiden has done a super chat saying, uh, talk of movie watch along made me think of Muppets Christmas Carol and I now find myself humming It Feels Like Christmas. It's the, the best. It's such a good fucking film. Uh, I'm planning to go to a, a sing-along at the Prince Charles Cinema again in, in Leicester Square this year because it's always great. Um, you just... Oh, God, the forest feels so nice. Now, look. All the damage just goes through. There's no 0 0.5 fire pits. Lovely. Know this guy. He's got no chance. Oh, I'm a, I'm a slime. I'm gonna come hurt you. No, you're not. Look, I'll even do a round of shit damage on you to give you hope. Oh no, there's a second one. Oh bollocks. <laughs> okay, well, let's. Uh... Not my best. Not my worst. And there we go. Oh, my back. Oh, back's a little stiff today. Not sure why, but so it goes. Crete. Ah, I should have reloaded there, shouldn't I? Ah, well. CO Tog says, hey, hey, CO Tog. Been a while. How you doing? Uh, hey, Johnny and Alice, please. Happy Monday. What is this? Damaged by Plinko? <laughs> this is Peglin. Uh, we're a little goblin who's on an adventure, and we fight enemies by, yeah, just basically doing pachinko stuff. Uh, Kira Cox says, okay, I have pudding and whiskey and caramel sutra ice cream. I am actually going to work now, so if you all see me posting, ask me if I'm working, please. Will do, Kira. Also, pudding and whiskey and ice cream sounds like a great way to go to work. Assuming you're not, like, driving a school bus. You know, uh, let's get, let's get, let's grab one spinesse after attacking. Fuck it, why not? Let's try the ballad. Well, and let's buy a, no, we can't afford that. Can't afford anything more. We could upgrade an orb, but we're not going to. Kira Cox says, I meant starting home, homework, homeworking, so I am fine. All right. Just checking, just checking. Um, you know what? I don't really mind. Boing! Which way are we gonna go? Oh yeah! You heal when you're navigating. This is the navigation where you can heal. Thank you, Colin. Don't forget, Johnny, there's a shop coming up. So don't spend all your money. Dodgy dagger. Whenever you evade an attack using Borlusion, gain one spinesse. Borlusion provides X percent chance to avoid any incoming attack. Borlusion is reduced when an attack is successfully avoided. But I haven't used Borlusion. Ambidex Ambidex generi. Yeah, plus one orb discards. Sure, why not? Let's take that. Doom 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 boo doo doom boom boom. Actually wouldn't have minded the fight there, but oh well. Beep boo doo doo boom. Maybe it'll be a fight anyway. It isn't. You find yourself looking at two identical altars. Let's duplicate the ballad. 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 I get the pun now. Ballad. Like ballad, but ball. Great. Well done, Johnny. Yeah, fuck the shop. Or let's go to the shop. Let's go to the shop. Good. Wizzy McWizzerton says, Hey guys, everyone doing okay? Doing all right, thanks, Wizzy. This game is great. It is uh, called Peglin. Uh, oh, Bolusion. There it is. I uh, Finally, we've taken the relic to do with Bolusion. Buckle Orb. Grants Bulwark 3 every 14 pegs hit. Bulwark is armor that protects HP. Damage taken will reduce Bulwark first. Let's take this. Let's take that one. Why not, eh? Ah, oh, we could have caught the basil, basil totem again. Oh well. We finally bought something from the shop. Look at us go. Good. 
Lemony knows his hubris strikes so often in this game. Haha. <laughs> Emma Benton says, You're so fickle. Yeah, fair enough. I bet you think this song is about you, don't you? Get fucked, little orb. Not orb, slime. <gasps> it's the ballard! Let's add some spinesse! Oh! Thought I was gonna hit the crit then. Not my bust. Spin S. Spin S X grants it. Oh, we got plus one. Okay. Well, that's fine. We can we can deal with that. Wink. I'll piss off. Well, at least we're getting more spin S. Oh no, I'm gonna get hit. Oh, maybe not. Oh, they're going to get hit by a bomb. Oh, I'd love a reload, though. I really would. Don't hate that, though. Don't hate that. Here comes the dagger one. That's a crit. That's a reload. That's what you want to see. Great. Complete overkill. Lemony Nose says, ooh, it's in finesse. I get it. Yeah, it's um, it's not one of the more obvious ones, I think. But Kiamon, I got some ball work there. Oh, they're so fucked. I think I'm about to throw like three bombs, maybe? One, two, three, f five. Okay, well, good. Re... Forbisher, like refurbisher, upgrades each peg hit, plus four damage, deals no damage. I like it though. Let's dip, oh, but Borlusion. Borlusion. Now let's buy the re refurbisher. Get pegged. <laughs> dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Boink. Great. Maybe increase the game speed a little. F key, bottom left, says Cinder the Fallen. Eh. Um, let's see. Oh, no. You reach a clearing that is unusually slimy. You progress cautiously, but still lose your step. Three orbs fall into the slime, and you only have two hands. Which one do you let sink into the slimy abyss? The pebble. You instinctively snatch up an orb in each hand, but you watch as the pebble, level one, disappears deep into the muck. All right. Oh, this is fun, look. Hee hee. Look at my little bunts. Oh, I wanted the fight. Oh, it would have been a big fight. Damn it. Ah, ranged again. Oh, we got a lot of shit coming up, actually. Well, good thing we're about to get some... Ball... What's it called again? Ball load. Spin S. Yeah! Oh, that didn't do loads, actually. Okay, this is the Rib Forb Orbisher. Oh, come on. Do more than that. Do more than that. Come on. Ah. Not great. But I've got some spinesse. Here's the but. I do not care at all for this particular map. Seems like a real bastard. That was good, at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 34. We'll take it. Ah, uh, no, a bit. Ooh. I'm not so sure about this, this level. I'm a little bit worried. Ow. Ooh, that was a bit of fun, wasn't it? John Rice has done a super chat saying, Got gangs of Sherwood because of your stream, and I'm loving it. Also, getting engaged on New Year's Eve. 
Thanks for helping me through the rough times. Congratulations, John. That's very exciting. Um, uh, I sincerely hope your uh, partner doesn't watch this stream. Um, uh, I'm glad you're enjoying uh, Gangs of Sherwood. Uh, just remember, proposing can be nerve-wracking. You're just going to have to be brave. <laughs> there we go. Not my best, not my worst. Craig M says, this is absolutely rocking my subwoofer. Lol. Peglin will do that. I mean, Peglin will do that. I'm sorry, Emma Benton. Oh. This is not, this is not my bust. Good score, kind of overkill. I'm not sorry, no, I'm really not sorry. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Yeah, it's that simple. Ah, oh, that was shit. That was good, though. Right. We got 64 monies. What's this? Oh, the reorganizer. Of course. Duplicate orb. Duplicates hit crits and meh, 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 meh. Let's get another ball lightning. And let's heal. Boring as that may seem. No, I was really hoping for a bit more healing than that, but oh well. Doom, do, do, do. <laughs> Take relic. Re oh, look at the sword. It's a familiar shape. Refill a buster. Very good. Whenever the board is refreshed, deal damage to target enemy equal to the number of pegs restored. Love that. Or improved catalyst bombs deal plus 10 damage. It'll be the refill a buster, please. Like the buster sword, but refilling, but also a filibuster, which is a thing uh, when you are trying to um, prevent a vote in a legislature, legislative body by uh, doing a speech so long uh, that uh, it runs out of time. Um, I think, I think hmm, maybe the record's been broken. The record in the US um, in the House used to be held by Strom Thurmond who's a real piece of shit. <laughs> um, former governor of South Carolina Oh, sorry, was a real piece of shit. He died. Oh, in 2003. Look at that. Um, Strom Thurmond. Uh, uh, what's the filibuster record? Is it still his? Ugh. Yeah. The filibuster and extended speech design to stall legislation began at 8.54 p.m. and lasted until 9.12 p.m. the following day, a duration of 24 hours and 18 minutes, uh, making it the longest single-person filibuster in the United States Senate history, a record that still stands as of 2033. What was he filibustering? The Civil Rights Act of 1957. That's right. Fuck you, Strom Thurmond. <laughs> anyway, that's what a filibuster is. <clears throat> right. Yikes indeed, Lemony Nose. <laughs> Yikes indeed. Okie dokie, right, we're up against more plant bastards. Look, can't say you don't learn something coming into these streams, hey. Yeah, we don't hate it. <laughs> Reese says Strom Thurmond's grave is a perfectly acceptable gender neutral toilet gang. For legal reasons, I cannot endorse that. I cannot say that that is definitely very funny. <laughs> you know, it's tricky. <laughs> Mm, 
Now, where's our little... Where's our friend who's the re-orbanizer? No, it's not the reorganizer. It's the... Oh, no, it's a relic. Oh, brilliant. Okay, well, we're at, we'll actually hold off on uh, refilling that for a while, if we can. Oh, we just did. Okay, well, that's all right. Oh, ho, ho. Because deal damage targets in... Yeah, okay. Well, that's all right. I was hoping to do loads of bonus damage for the refresh. Hmm. Eleanor Smith says, hey gang, are we a Peggle channel now? Not quite. Uh, it is a Peglin. We're a little goblin. This little Peglin up here. This little green guy. And these are our enemies. And we will defeat them using pegs and balls. Um, yes, Bulwark. Yes, hit more. Did I hit 14? I didn't. Damn. Um, it's great. Sarah Burke says, I never got the Steam not uh, stream notification. Sorry I'm late. You're not late. You're Well, this may not be precisely when you meant to arrive, uh, but it's all good. The nice thing about streaming is that um, you can show up whenever you want to, to, to tune in. I promise you I will never be upset by, by that. Can't promise I'll never be upset. Oh. Oh, look. We killed it just with the refresh filibuster sword. Refilibuster sword. Um, Boliviation applies damage reduction slime to every 16 pegs hit. Each damage, reduc damage reduction slime on the board reduces incoming damage, incoming damage by one. Damage reduction slime melts off at the start of each shot. Eh. Twoo's company we've already had. Reorganizer. Um, I'm going to get another bat. Ballard. Ballard. Should we heal up just to be safe? Let's heal up just to be safe. Fuck it, why not? Because I fancy this. I want to see what this is like. Oh, look. A bat. Jesus Christ, it's a minotaur with an axe. Let's give it one of these. Whoa! Ho, 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 ho. Go on, crit it. Crit oh, yes! Lovely. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Do some good. Do some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it could have been worse. 88 is not not a terrible amount of damage to do. <laughs> Adam says, "Jesus Christ, it's Jason Horns." <laughs> I enjoyed that very much. Very much. Thank you. Uh-oh. It has reached me. No, I don't reach... Oh, bollocks. Oh, that was a terrible use of reload tiles. But we got a crit. Oh, oh god, this is going to hurt so bad. Deals no damage. A terrible time to have this orb. We bin it. We bin it off. It's going to hurt a lot. 22 damage. Made me spit everywhere. Good lord. <laughs> Nephew to go says, a minotaur on screen is called a monitor. Emma Benton says, lose it in a maze. It's a good idea. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting the 26 damage. With any luck, we can do it in before. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> Get pegged! <laughs> okay. Oof, dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Inferno Orb, lighter than other orbs, detonate bonds in one hit. Ah, uh, no. Uh, I'm, I want to heal again, unfortunately, which means that we can't... Uh, we can afford one of these. Swaltorb! Yeah, let's take a Swaltorb. Oh, Andrew F., I'm really sorry to hear the news, but I hope you are well, and thank you very much for the kind words. Uh, intentional Oboe. Whenever, whenever you would lose health and resistance. 
Stacked Orbicus. Very good. Each Every enemy starts with three Exploitable. Enemies affected by Exploitable receive 10% extra damage per stack on critical attacks. Sure, we'll start with Stacked Orbicus. Uh, let's have a let's have a fucking fight. Orbo, it was right there. Yeah, Orbo is great. Says my cat is typing this. Damn it! Well, I fucked it up. Emma Benton says the last time I saw people this obsessed with orbs, Crackdown had just come out. Crackdown two was great. Crackdown three sank without a fucking trace, didn't it? Okay, come on, upgrade those orbs, baby. Yep, yep, great, good work. All we need to refill and we'll be golden. Come on, do lots of bouncing, please, you shit. That wasn't great. Oh, there are so many baits. Which one's this? Buck, buckle orb. Oh, like a buckler shield, but it's an orb. I get it, I get it. I get it. Great, a bomb. We'll absolutely take a bomb. Lovely. Eleanor Smith says, I love pondering orbs. Me too. A plant here is a dangerous tool, Solomon. Okay. Oh, look, it's a bait. I only just noticed. Uh, we ideally need a crit from this dag orb, so let's bin it off. We don't need it. Ball lightning. We'll take that. Come on. Eh. Yeah, okay. Oh, this bat's at full health. What do you think about bat? Now you know how I feel. That bat's dead. That bat's so dead. Great. That was easy. <gasps> Jack-o-lantern orb. Instead of exiting the pegboard, this orb will return to the top of the pegboard one time. Can target any enemy. Love that. Love the jack orb lantern. Elucircle. Elucircle. El el elu Elused like an illusion. Elucircle. I only got that because I read about Borlusion. Orblation. Orblation targets any enemy, any enemy, does a lot of damage, and can deal six unblockable, but deal six unblockable self-damage when fired. So fuck that. Let's take the pumpkin one. Come on. Come in. Jack Orb Lantern. Oh, it's shit damage though, isn't it? Mm, maybe we should. Maybe we should be brave. Maybe we should be brave. Let's get Orblation. Fuck it. Ah, oh, Will's in chat. Hello, Will. How you doing? This is Peglin. It's bloody great. I like it very, 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 very much. You reach a clearing with a strange amount of crows circling above. You don't think much of it until they start to drop pebbles on you. Use your satchel to catch the pebbles, plus three pebbles, or run, lose nine HP. I don't really want the pebbles. What do I have? What do I actually have? I've got two pebbles. Mm. I'm going to take the hit. You sprint through the clearing as the stones rain down on you. You take a few knocks, but at least you don't have to lug around any extra pebbles. Exactly. 626 Games has done a super chat saying, I finally catch a live one and I have to leave for a Zoom meeting, but at least I can finally show some support. Catch them later on VOD. Oh, thank you, 626 Games. I hope your Zoom meeting is succinct and enjoyable and that no one le oh, leaves themselves on mute, am I right? Um, uh, honestly, I really hope um, I really hope uh, it, it goes well. And I will catch you on VOD. In fact, if you're watching this now on VOD, hello from the past. I hope the future is nice. Let's 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 find out, I guess. Ah, okay. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Andrew Roberts says the pegs will be back and in greater numbers. All right, it's the slime guy again.
That's gone all right. And now we're getting plus one spinness. Ugh. Ow. I forgot that he's got range. Yes, a bomb. We've primed another bomb. Yes. And he's got three stacks of exploiter ball. Mm. Now we're not going to... Oh, no, we did get the crit. Great, okay. Oh, I don't hate that. 125. Thanks to the exploiter ball. Will says, how often does this game play Ode to Joy at you? Unfortunately, not at all, but the music is amazing. So, I don't hate it. Uh, nice Witch says, got a dip for work. Take care, Skellies. Always peg safely. You too, Nice Witch. I hope you have a bloody uh, lovely time at work. I hope it passes very smoothly and without an uh, unfortunate event. Uh, love you very much, pal. I will catch you soon, I am sure. Holy shit, that guy got zapped by like a god. Here's the buckle orb. I'd like to reload if I can, but the reload's all the way over there. Let's just see what happens. A crit. A veritable crit. That was not the best go. Orthogonalist has done the super chat saying, been a while since I've thrown a buck your way, so here. Also, hello, I have arrived precisely when my shift at work allowed me to. Hello, hello, Orthogonalist. Thank you very much for the um, for the buck that you have thrown my way. Um, it is good to see you. I hope your shift at work was all right. Yes, that's what we wanted. Big crits all day. You're dead now. Okay. 82 monies. Uh, susceptible. On every crit hit, apply one exploiter ball. I do like exploiter ball, actually. It does good crit damage. Swall Torb ain't bad either. Splat Orb. Ball lightning's good. Let's get ourselves a Susceptor Ball and a Swall Torb. Because we deserve it. We deserve nice things. You know? Oh, take Relic. Molten Mantle. You can no longer attain, obtain money in battles, but your current shot's total damage is dealt to the targeted enemy every th No. Well... Mm, no. Consuming Chalice. All orbs get plus zero, plus four, but boards contain one fewer. Reload. Don't hate that. No. Wand of Skultimate Greed. Battles start with twice as many money, but all purchases are twice as expensive. I don't love any of these, really. Uh, the Consuming Chalice is kind of interesting. Fuck it, let's take that. Fuck it, why not? Why not? Forest complete. Will says, I did get to see Beethoven's Ninth performed by a full choir and orchestra from like the third row once, and the start of the fourth movement blew my fucking face off. I know, right? <laughs> Terrifying. Um, I've actually seen Beethoven's Ninth performed maybe ten times now. My my, um, I go with uh, my dad every year. It's a weird tradition we have. Um, and it's fantastic. Um... It's just, it never gets old. Really bloody never gets old. Um, Beethoven's Ninth. Okay, here come two bastards with, sh well, one with a shield, one with a bow. We got a ballad here, ballad. Let's just see what comes out of it. Good luck or a quick death has, has uh, done a super check. Good luck or a quick death uh, can, has added no message. Because good luck or a quick death. For as long as I've known them, it's always been the strong and silent type. Thank you very, very much. I've... Woo that's a good go. Very much appreciate it. Um, I hope you are well, my pal. Cameron says, I've sung the Ode to Joy with a Philharmonic choir before, and fuck me, is it boring to sing. <laughs> well, thank you for your service anyway, because I think it's lovely. But then again, I'm listening to it, not... Uh, singing it, so. A bomb for that guy. Okay, that guy's nearly dead, so that's nice. Ah! Oh, no, more of them. Right. Well, that bomb's gonna help. Because then it's gonna kill those two. And 
reduce the shield on this guy. All right, this is going okay. We could really do with a reload, actually. I'm not sure how to get it. I just have to... Ooh, I... No. No. Will says, I had to learn it for my fourth grade double bass, and it's a bugger to play too, so solidarity, Cameron. Some, oh, but some of the bits in Bass Homer's Ninth with the double basses. One of my favourite bits in uh, Bass Homer's Ninth is the whole bit where they're like, damn, damn, damn. Da -na, damn, damn, damn. Da -na. Because the harmonies are just like, nah, they're amazing. They're brilliant. It's just a good piece of music. I really need this reload. Come on. Fucked it. Ah, uh, no. This is bad. And I took the relic that gave us one fewer. You want? Come on. Ah, cock. Nearly dropped the C-bomb then, actually. Okay, I think... We should get out of this alive, maybe. Crit. But to what end? Come on. Guess it. Guess us a fucking fuck. Oh, this is very bad. Okay, no, we can do this. Yeah. Yes! There it is. There it bloody is. All right, we got a chance. All right, there we go. Woo! Dum dum. Oh, there's a reload there now, is there? Fine. Can get another reload? Sure, why not? Oh, and a crit. Oh, this guy's dead. Look at that. I didn't realize how little health he had left. Yep, yeah, sure. Why not? That's two crits. That's 318 damage coming his way after this bomb. Job done. Cool. Um, ba -ba 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 -da -ba -da. Swashbucklorb. Money collected from hit money pegs contribute an additional one times damage. Can target any enemy. I hate that one. Uh, multi ball. Renewed Vigorb. Adds one must circle. Every three times the board is refreshed. Meh. Let's take the swashbuckle orb. And then... Oh, no, I can't afford to heal that. Oh, well. Hopefully we're all right. Woofed. Chest or question mark? Chest or question mark? Let's fire it at the bomb and see what happens. Oh, fuck. Well, that didn't go how I wanted. Let's do that. Let's see what happens. No! Chest it is. Take care, Murphy, to go. I hope the shop is nice to you and for for you. All right, what's in the chest? Take relic, round guard. You're immune to attack damage while reloading. Okay. Tactical treat. Yeah, I'll we'll take a tactical treat. Why not? Nailed it. Okay. Oh yeah, I've got super boots. Thanks, call me mug. Very good reminder. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm fighting three mirrors. Right, let's take the... Let's get the crit. Oh, yeah, look, it's mirroring all of the things. And I got a crit. That's nice. For me! <laughs> get mirrored. Dave mirrored. BMX. <laughs> no idea why. Sorry, everyone. Ow! It mirrored some of the things.
Hooray! Okay. What's this one do again? The Swaltorb. Good crit damage on a Swaltorb as well. Yes! Fucking yes! Fucking yes! Great. Perfect. That was very easy. Nata, Nata Get says, wow, this is confusing. Um, okay. Uh, let me uh, uh, explain it to you on the next go. Sorry, my brain I forgot the word for explain. And instead I made a weird guttural noise. Um, Reorganizer. Spinfectious sting. Let's do a bit. Oh, let's heal. Yeah? Yeah? I remembered. Let's upgrade an orb. Sod it. Why not? What do we like? The swashbuckle orb? No. The swalt orb? Oh, let's upgrade the orblation. Why not? My cat is typing this, says I'm off. See you later. Take care, my cat is typing this. Again, lots of love to you. I hope things start looking up soon. Uh, oh, the reorganizer would have been a good shout if I was missing the reloads. Ah, well. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm healing so much. That's useful. Okie dokie. Right, so... Um, this is Peglin. I'm a little goblin who plays Peggle, basically. But it's not Peggle. Um, and it's kind of a bit like Slay the Spire. So right now, we're having a random encounter. And then there will be a combat encounter soon after that. There are bosses, there are relics, there are treasures. It's a lot of fun. We're walking down a quiet hall and one of the bricks under my feet groans at me. I move my foot as an extremely weathered brick slime flips to reveal its face. Gra, I'm retired. Leave me alone already. Wait, are those delicious pebbles I smell? I'll tell you what, let me eat and we'll, we'll pretend this never happened. Sure, let's give it some pebbles. The brick slime crunches, crunches the pebbles to dust, lets out a satisfied grunt and then returns to its slumber. You can turn on your... You re, continue on your way. That was the word I was looking for. Right, here comes a combat encounter. So... Enemies are here. These are uh, mirrors. They've got lots of health uh, and they'll re re return 4% of the damage I deal to them unless I kill them in one go. These are bastard pot plants that will fire things at me. Um, and this is the board. I've got an orb up here. There are different types of orbs. Um, hitting pegs will accumulate damage, which I will do to my enemies like this. Uh, it's currently being mirrored because I'm in a hall of mirrors. Don't worry too much about it. Uh, and then at the end of the go, once the ball goes down there, boing, there goes the damage. There we go. Uh, what's this? Reforbisher. So we want this to hit a lot of pegs. Ideally, we want them all to hit a lot of pegs, but you know what I mean. Yep, that was Gash. Oh, no. Meep. Oh, Could have been worse. Could have been better. Here's the swashbuckle orb. So we want this to hit lots of coin ones. Has it? Has it? Fuck. Oh, a bomb though. The bomb has been... The fuse has been lit, which is useful. Ah. Oh, I liked that. That was a fun animation. Oh, dear. Ooh, only a cat says, going back to the start as I love Johnny's dreams when I'm pulling apart ships. I'm on a chilled playthrough of Hard Space Shipbreaker and I need something to soothe me through the ghost ships. Yeah, fuck those things. Jesus Christ. Um, but I love Hard Space Shipbreaker so much. Um, I've been... I started a playthrough when the weather started turning. For some reason, it's a real winter game for me. I should get back to that. Okie dokie. What we got now? Yeah, take damage, you big mirror. Ooh, I'm not doing very well here, it feels like. Where's that reload? Fire! No. Fire! Fucking... There we go. For a second there, I thought I hit anything but the, uh, the reload one. Yes! Okay, that's a good amount of damage. Up yours, big mirror. Okay, so this one, we're going to take some damage... It can target any enemy, and it does great damage on a crit, so we want to get it to crit if we can. Let's target the big mirror. Yeah, 
yes, yes, big mirror. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Yes, it's dead. That was a very nice go. It's still going, in fact. A thousand damage? I'd buy that for a dollar. It's not dead. Piss off. Alright, fine. Big crits all day. Ah, oh, I was trying to hit the bomb. I did not hit it. But this is some good damage. Okay, great. Great, we did it. Ooh, what's this? Echo Orb. Attacks all enemies. Echo 30. Echo X deals X percent of the previous attack damage as bonus damage. Let's have that. Lovely. Let's definitely heal up. Because we need to. Mashakosha Masha 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 says, Big crit energy. You're damn right, big crit energy. Boink. <laughs> Please, I just want the ball to go down somewhere. Oh, fully clear of pegboard. Spring cleaning. We got an achievement. Hooray! Just Mash is fine. Understood, Mash. Orthogonalus says I have 160 hours in this game. It's going to get 160 more. Bloody hell. Was it you who recommended it to me? Because I feel like I... Whoever it was, I owe them a drink. You stumble into a strange mirror with shadows flickering in the reflection. You're drawn closer and closer until your nose is nearly touching the glass. Should we remove an orb? I don't want to remove all orbs. Let's remove an orb. What should we get rid of? I'll be honest, the dag orbs... Mm, we upgraded it, didn't we? We can get rid of one ball lad. Will says it was me, 100%. Right, there we go. <laughs> Cool, great. Job done. You embrace the infernal energy and push your ba push your ballard through the mirror. You hope the shadows make good use of it. Well, Will, I owe you a drink. Will says, haha, three pints secured. Yes, I thought that might be the case, but I've said it now. And honestly, I'd stand you a drink anyway. That does not mean you can have two free pints. Follow for more cunning scams. Hmm. Oh. You find a forge, hot and ready to smelt, yet oddly unattended. You think that you could use it, but your little peglin hands aren't made to handle the heat. We can upgrade a random orb, or scoop up the forge and get a special relic, or we can leave. Let's get a special relic. Perfect forger. Whenever an orb is added to your deck, upgrade it and take four damage. Yeah, alright, I'll take that. Sure. You manage to slide your satchel over the forge, and it disappears into the void. You're not sure why you thought this would work, but you're glad you tried it. Oh, blimey bit of fun. Are we gonna go chest or question mark? Looks like question mark. Question mark. Okay. Oh. And then uh, I'll tell you what, I'll do this little bit. So we can either get a bucklorb, a darkness eterball. Cool. Or a splatorb. Let's try a name for that. No, nope, fucked it. Let's try and go for that way. Um, either way. Okay, buckle orb. Sure, we can have that. Um, oh, now let's go this way. Once we are at the next level. Okay, let's pause. Uh, let's take a five minute break because it's uh, nearly... 6 p.m. here in in London and all of the you know the places that share a uh, longitude longitudinal position with this bit of the world. Let's take a five to seven minute break. Uh, I'm going to get some water and have a little stretch and go to the toilet. Uh, maybe have a little snack. Who even knows? The world for the next five to seven minutes is my oyster, um, as it is yours. When was the last time you got up? Um, 
another little stretch. Are you hungry? Are you thirsty? Are you too warm? Are you too cold? Is there anything you need to do that you can get done in the next five, seven minutes that would enhance your enjoyment of the rest of this stream? If so, go do it. If not, here comes a picture of my dog and some smooth jazz. But actually, first, I'm going to do uh, read out the super chat from Holby, their first ever super chat on a live stream, which reads, I must go as I have my own goblins to wrangle, but I will pass on their advice. Get the bombs! Have fun, everyone. Catch you later. Thank you very much, Holby. Take care of yourself. I will... Um, I will catch you soon. I hope um, I hope your gomblin, go, gomblin? goblin wrangling goes well. Uh, right, so uh, here we go. Five to seven minute break. See you very shortly. Be right back.
Hello friends, I'm back. And you're back, if you're watching this. Or, I don't know, you could be hearing this from another room. Whatever. Uh, I'm Johnny Chiodini, you're watching me <laughs> streaming Peglin on youtube.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. Um, how was your break? I had a little stretch, I said hi to the dog, uh, I went to the toilet, uh, and I got myself, yum yum yum, a little treat. I'm having a can of Guinness Zero Percent. Mm-hmm. If I push that boat much further out, I won't be able to see it. Uh, genuinely though, of all of the non-alcoholic beers I've tried, this is up there with the best of them. This and Lucky Saint are very good. Look, it even does the cascade. Ooh. I know, I'm a little fancy Dan. Just fancy little treat. And I'm, uh, Emma Burton says, is it good? My partner has been wanting to try it. You know what? It is really good. It's it's similar enough to normal Guinness. It's a little bit sweet, but then non-alcoholic beers tend to be. Uh, Lillian LePame says, is that 0% alcohol, 0% fat, or 0% sugar? It's 0% alcohol. No, that's, that's not actually that sugary. So that's good. Um... And it appears to be fat free, so whoopee. Um, but yeah, look at Sue. You're like, mmm. It's like, mmm. Like I'm having a real beer. Uh, so I'm drinking less at the minute. But I fancied a little, a little, a little something something. So there we go. I'll be honest with you. I got loads of these in when I had a game of Blood Bowl uh, at my flat. And uh, you don't. It, Blood Bowl's not an easy game to play after a couple of beers. So I was like, if I get a bunch of alcohol free beers, my opponent and I can enjoy those. And not worry too much about the game. Blah, 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 blah. Anyway, Monica Truong says, uh, I have to go now. Um, take care, Monica. I uh, hope you're very well. I've suddenly given myself a a, 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 a frighten that I've said your, uh, your username, your surname wrong. Because it's been a long, t it's been a while. So apologies if so. Izzy Mary says, Blood Bowl? Yeah, Blood Bowl. It's my favourite game. It's, well, one of my favourite games. It's a tabletop game. It's like um, Warhammer's version on uh, of uh, American football. And I co-commissioned a league. It's very good fun. Let's see what's in this chest. Strange Brew. Activated. Uh, ooh. Activated reloads and crits contribute to damage. That's fun. Or Ambiguous am Amulet. Wall bouncers contribute to damage. Let's get the Ambiguous Amulet. Do, 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 do. Paul Harrower says, I'm back with tea and a partner. Great success. Well done, Paul. On both of those things. Let's just send it straight up. A chest. Actually wouldn't have minded the fight, really, but hey-ho. Oh, great. And then we go to the shop, and then we got a big fight. Ooh. Angel Beat says, ambiguous amulet. It me. Also, hi. Hello, Angel Beat. How are you doing? This is, uh, this is Peglin. It's great. Refresher course. Every four times the board is... Smoke mod. Apply blind one when damaging... Bombs apply blind one when damaging enemies. Sure, let's take that. Why not? No, it's not that good. Let's take this one. Sure, why not? Ah, right, let's go to the shop. It just, like... Yeah, I don't know. cold. It seems relatively beer-like. Paul Harrower says, for context, it's not a new partner. She's just home from work. I assumed I assumed that it was a pre-existing partner. Do not worry. Rach H says, my three and a half month old son just woke up from his nap and is absolutely fascinated by this stream. I love hearing things like this because number one, like, cool, great. I'm glad to be providing colourful, like, moving, um, you know, fun things to watch. Uh, for, for three and a half month old, uh, but also uh, I can still swear because a three and a half month old doesn't understand what I'm saying when I say fuck or other swears, and that's great. So there we go. Uh, dag orb. Uh, can't, let's bin the dag orb. Don't want to do it. Susceptible. It's also not great, but you know what? This guy is a thousand health. That's bad. Let's hope we get that crit. Yes. 
That's not too shabby for a very first. Don't hate that. 302 damage for the f ah, for the first one. Okay. We want to get a crit on this bastard as well, really. But you know what? We'll just go for it. Come on. Please be great. Yep, 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 yep. Because yep. you do plenty damage with crits. Yes! Oh, this... Oh, my God. He's only got 90 health left. That has gone exceedingly well. Although he's now got... Full walk. Uh, you know what? Could be worse. Let's crit this one as well. Why not? Woohoohoo! That should have been a lot harder than it was, I feel. Uh, signal boost orb. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Signal boost orb. Um... This orb is affected by Mus, mus Circle, Spinesse, and Borlance two times. Uh, no. Mm, Inferno Orb, no. Ballad, Ballad. Oh, we need to heal, really. That's what we need to do. We could get a multi-ball. Let's do it. Let's get multi-ball. Paul Um uh, has done a super chat saying, Said partner has requested Genie Dini. It's her small nickname for when we watch your videos. Oh, uh, specific advice for getting old, as it is her birthday soon. Apologies. Firstly, happy birthday for soon, uh, said partner. Uh, secondly, Jeannie Deanie. Big fan of that. Lovely. Big, 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 big fan. Um, advice for getting old. Just try not to worry about it. It happens to all of us. And you know what? I'm actually enjoying being older uh, quite a lot. Because I sort of, I feel like I have a much greater sense of who I am, and kind of the shit I will and will not stand for, um, which is just quite nice. It's just like, sure, I feel like you know, a lot of the times I'm bored, like I'm boring now, or my body's already failing me, or you know, you know, yada yada yada, and it's like, oh, do you remember when we used to do this, and you know, we we felt invincible, and blah 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 blah, um. You know what? The trade-off's pretty great because I feel quite comfortable in who I am and I, I bloody love a nap. <laughs> so just, you know, just try and embrace it. You're doing great. Um, thank you very much to, to Paul for the super chat. Uh, and again, happy birthday soon, said partner. Do not worry about getting old. It's it's. I think it's more of a blessing than it is a curse, quite genuinely. Um, and also, my God, Jeannie Deanie. Mwah. When your deck is shuffled, each orb's damage and crit are randomly rolled. No. Refreshing punch. Uh, yeah. Pumpkin pie. Each shot, a random slot becomes a portal that can teleport orbs to the top of the pegboard up to three times. We're getting some pumpkin pie up in this motherfucker. Let's do it. Smug Borgin has done a super chat saying, I've arrived precisely when I mean to. And going back to the start, but wanted to say hi from me and Archie, my new two-year-old Labradoodle. He likes your voice. Aww. Please, um, please send my very, very best to, uh, to Archie, who sounds like an absolute bloody delight. Um, ah, and yeah, lots of love, lots of love to you, Smug Morgan. Thank you very much for the super chat. Um, enjoy the stream, it's a wild ride. Okie dokie, it's boss time. We've got 68, oh, that's a whole fucking ballista, isn't it? Oops. Oh, I accidentally binned that orb off. Oh, well. Fuck it, let's just crit it. Got to come out strong on this, I think. Yeah, sure, that'll do. Good God, that hurt. Well, there's no getting out of this one, is there? Why am I spinning? Did you make me spin? Welcome. Oh, they confused me. I got confused. I'm so fucked. Orthogonalist says, is this the first run or has Johnny died before? This is the second run. Echorb. Okay, I got a crit. Okay, that was pretty decent. That controlled a lot of, that killed a lot of mobs for me, but... I do not anticipate I will live to see out this fight, if I'm perfectly honest. 
Especially with a fucking shot like that. Rubbish! Has this guy got a mop? What is that? Looks like he's got a mop. What's this guy do again? Upgrades. Oh, deals no damage. Bin it. Swaltorb! Swaltorb! I choose you, etc, etc. Oh no. Oh dear. No, stop reloading it! Oh fuck. Yes, crit. Good. We like crit. And I think at least one bomb's going out there. Lovely. We're still going to fire. Ow. I am somewhat unsurprisingly confused. And thus cannot control the specific direction of my orbs. I'm so boned. Oh, bomb! Okay, that's huge. That is enormous. I need, basically, I need to set up a, a bomb every single fucking turn now. Otherwise, it gets to reload. And if it fires one more time, I am dead. Okay, a bomb, that's great. We're staying alive for now. We set off the bomb. No, that's not going to be any good. Catastrophe says, just joining this, I used to love Paggles. Very interested to see what this is like. It's great. I bloody love it. I bloody love it. It's fantastic. Oh, come on. Oh, please. Oh, please. Okay, we'll take the reload. Oh, no, we're fucked. Absolutely boned. Oh, well. It was a good try. The music, though. Yeah, that's us dead, isn't it? Oh, look, we got little angel wings. I didn't see that before. Paul Harrower has done a super chat saying, Some more cash. You approving of her nickname for you has made her day. It's a bloody good nickname. And, like, I, I feel like I need to emphasise at this point, there are so few people in this world who have successfully made an enjoyable nickname off, off Johnny Chiodini. People have tried Houdini, which is just rubbish. Um, a guy I went to uni with, uh, uh, actually Tom Rosenthal from Friday Night Dinner used to call me Chemo Dini, uh, which was fine, uh, but not brilliant. Uh, I will say actually, uh, there was one. So my my mum is is fine, uh, but she got diagnosed with cancer when I was at uni. And I told him, it came out one day when I was hanging out with some people and he went, still going to call you it. And I was like, you know what? I respect that. That's that's a bold move. And you know what? It, it actually, in a weird way, it was quite reassuring because he wasn't treating me with kid gloves. Like I genuinely do respect him for it. Uh, but anyway, like I say, like not many good nicknames off, off Johnny Chiodini. So... So that one is not. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna read it again. Genie Dini, Genie Dini. It's brilliant. I love it. I love it. It's great. Right. Let's go again. I feel like it's gonna be a long time until I win a battle with at least 100 ball walk remaining, or win a battle after inflicting 50 plus spin infection on any enemy, or get that many slimed pegs. I feel like I'm gonna be playing as Peglin for a long old time. Would you like a boost? Wouldst thou like to live deliciously? <laughs> mm. Sand arrows. Attacks apply blind four to enemies. I don't hate that, actually. Uh, ambiguous amulet. Or the round guard. Let's take... Ambiguous, am ambiguous amulet, sure. Ah, Nakurika. I hope I said that right. It says no wings last time because you got swallowed. Yes. A good, a good spot. Oof. Swallowed by Imhotep. Right, let's go have a fucking fight. So, Cat, this is very, as you probably guessed from the map, very Slay the Spire. These are the enemies up here. I do damage by um, bouncing the base, basically by playing Peggle. It's great. It's just fucking brilliant, this. Nick Jeffries in chat. Hello. Nick says, hey, Johnny, how are you this wet Monday? I just got in from food shopping. Luckily, I missed the worst of the rain, and a bus appeared to bring me home that wasn't on the electronic screen. Secret bonus bus? 
Um, big fan of that. Uh, I hope the shopping went well, Nick. Um, I'm doing all right, thanks. Um, I avoided the rain uh, when I walked the dog today, which was pleasant. And uh, I was out, was out walking the dog, and a mate of mine text going, "Have I missed today's dog walk?" And I said, "No, it's just begun." So, uh, monk, googly, googly-eyed skull, and I uh, walked the pig, uh, which was very nice. And then I did some admin, and now I'm streaming. So yeah, generally speaking, rain avoided. Nice day being had, which is pleasant. Um, Josh Warriad has done a super chat saying, Ah, the tragedy of Peglin death. I must be gone to construct and then eat dinner, <laughs> but I look forward to seeing the rest of your adventures on VOD. Thank you very much, Josh. Um, I hope dinner construction goes very well. I'm now imagining you eating some sort of elaborate tower made out of oven chips. That's just what I'm imagining, and nobody can correct me. Um, but yeah, take care of yourself. And if you're watching this on VOD, hello. Uh, Sebastian Mendoza says, upgrade first. I don't want to upgrade the dag orb. I don't like the dag orb. Uh, no, 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 no. What's going to say? Danilla Dragon says, My 11 year old is also watching, but trust me, Johnny, she's also learning swearing from me, not just you. Good stuff. Go team. Now, swearing is great. It's just all about knowing when to swear and when not to swear. That's the, that's the trick. So my parents didn't mind me swearing at home, but they, they always made me. You know, they, they made me very much imagine, uh, not imagine, very much aware of when it was and wasn't appropriate to swear. And I feel like, you know what, that was, that was great. Um, it really set me up. Um, real, I, I want the, I'm going to buy the reorganizer. Johnny can have reorganizer as little a treat. I don't want to upgrade anything. There we go. Reese says, I also need to make dinner at some point. Been relearning how to cook, which has been good. Nice. What's your favorite thing that you've cooked recently? Uh, I made a mushroom stroganoff this week, which I haven't done in, in a good long while. Um, uh, and it was tasty. Uh, let's go Let's go have a fucking fight. Colin Lasser says, did you just say orb grade instead of upgrade? I did, but Meffy to go said it first. So I can't take credit for that. Our reorganizer, that's right. Reorganize. Let's reorganize the things. Ooh, I'm not sure about this board. I don't love it. <gasps> did we reorganize? I think we did. Okay. Now here comes the dag orb. Let's make sure we crit to get that sweet, sweet crit damage. Not my best. Ugh. Don't you come near me, slime with a sword, you little bastard. What? Oh, that was easy. Wow. Okay. Cassandra, ne Cassandra Needham um, has done a super chat saying, What were you doing while making a mushroom? <laughs> Cassandra? <laughs> That really got me. Hmm. Goodness me. Uh, well, it's not often I get a little bit flustered, but that's a good joke. I think it's I think it's because stroganoff sounds horrible in that context. Nimble, it's small. As spin S1, every three times a crit is triggered while the orb is in flight. Oh fuck that. Uh, angry Tomahawk. Base damage increases the lower your health is. Damage multiplier increases at higher orb levels. Sure, let's take it because it's new. Mmm. Reese says, ooh, good question. Got a recipe for a, an oregano and cranberry sauce, sausage burger, which was actually absolutely incredible. Very nice. Also, please enjoy how British people say oregano. Uh, oregano. Let's question mark it. Why not? Or not. Let's not, apparently. That's me told. There we go.
Take Relic. Unicorn Horn? Your aimer is longer and displays an additional bounce. Love that. Oh, Unicorn Horn. Oh, like from the Peggle. From the Peggle fellow. The... The Unicorn. What's his name? He's got a weird fucking name. Not a weird fucking name. He's got a, a very... Very, like, normal first name for a Unicorn. It's like Bruce or something. What the hell is the Peggle Unicorn called? Bjorn! Bjorn the Unicorn. Not that not that ordinary uh, a first name, actually. Now, now to think about it. Now to think about it. Super Boots. No, we're taking Bjorn's Horn. Okay, well look at this. Mmm, now we're playing Peggle. Look at this, look at this shit. Look at all these bank shots I'm gonna be able to mess up. Well, it showed me where it was going to go. Oh, I didn't do the big fight. Okay. Oh, I don't like it. That's weird. It feels strange and unusual, and I don't like it so much. No, I don't like it. Up yours, Bjorn. I loved it in Peggle, but no. I will say there's something about I don't know what it is specifically about Peggle, but the the peg the peg the peg action the pegins is not as good as as Peggle, but I flipping love this game. I think it's fantastic, and I can't put my finger on why Peggle feels more satisfying than this. Does it feel more satisfying, or does it just feel smoother and easier to control? I feel like I'm better at I'm better at getting specific shots in Peggle than I am at this. There we go. That's a better way of, of stating it. Uh, I don't really want to do... Uh, fuck it. Oh, no, I did get the crit. Okay, good. Fine. Well, that's overkill. That's 140 damage for a bat that had 15 health. Oh yeah, I forgot the wall counts towards damage now. That's so good. The escalating noises in Peggle help, says Aiden. That's a very good point. Zega Genesis says Peggle is more energetic in its bounces. I'm glad it's not just me that sort of has that innate feeling that Peggle's just a bit different. But um, I am enjoying this though. Oh, currently my angry Tomahawk is doing absolutely Tom or nothing in damage. Look at that. Whee! I shouldn't have thrown it at all, really. Nice one, Angry Tomahawk. That was my fault, really. Again, massive overkill, but we'll take it. Done. Okay. Ooh, ether wheel. Refresh the board when this orb leaves the pegboard. Yes, please. That sounds great. Yeah, we'll have that. Absolutely. Upgrade an orb. Can we upgrade the? No, we can upgrade the 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 Hulk. Mm. 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 No, I'm gonna save my money. I'm gonna save my money. Right, we wanna we wanna have a fight. I can't even bother to go to the shop. Yep. Dylan Long says, I've never played Peggle, but I played a lot of Bubble Bubble on Saturn. Oh, Bubble Bubble, that takes me back. Uh, ooh, insects. And it's a web look. Mmm. Love it. Great. We ne in fairness, we need some high damage because these bastards all have range and have a lot of health. 
Daniel Brown has done a super chat saying, Hey Johnny, the questioning of my gender identity has led me to want to be an eldritch horror so that anyone who perceives me goes insane. It's a lofty goal there, Daniel. I won't lie. Um, sounds like a lot of work, but uh, hey, who am I to get in the way of your joy? Uh, thank you very much for the super chat. Okay, I've taken some damage, so hopefully the angry tomahawk will do something now. Oh no, Issy Mary says got off the bus to stop early and was too embarrassed not to go through with it. Fuck me. Uh, yeah, that sucks. Uh, look, it's still doing no damage. Right, tomahawk is getting binned off. Um, that sucks, but you know what? It's good to get the steps in. It's good to get the steps in has become a real catchphrase for me. Whenever I'm, I have to do an unnecessary walk, doesn't matter what it is. If I've forgotten something, you know, at home and I got to double back, or if I've just missed the train and I have to walk, or en anything, anything, it's good to get the steps in. You know, it could be like a man chased me for two miles down the road wielding a hammer. It's good to get the steps in. It just, it, it helps. And you know what? It is. It's good to get the steps in. Marble Harbour says, ooh, this looks fun. It is, my friend. This is Peglin. I'm the little goblin that lives up here. These are my enemies. I'm crushing them through the power of pe pegs and orbs. There's got to be a better way of saying that. There was one time uh, Watson really needed the toilet but was too nervous to go to the toilet and didn't want to go. So I kept trying, to, like taking a, a 15 minute walk away from the house to see if she wanted to, wanted to go to the toilet. I took her up to the clearing five times in a day and she didn't go to the toilet. And it was really, uh, that was, uh, it's good to get the steps, steps in day. Let me tell you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Right, what we got? We got the mor morbid orb. Morbid. Morbid orbs allow you to activate... Oh, those are expired ones. Let's get the morbid orb, shall we? Let's add it. I'm going to save the rest of my money, because I want to see... A rub orb. Extra bounty. Uh, I want to see if there's a shop coming up. There is not. Because I want to get rid of the tomahawk, tomahawk orb, if I'm perfectly honest. But, um... That's fine. All right, maybe we will buy it. Let's buy the rub orb. Rub orb. Okay. Talking to getting the steps in. I really need to go back to the gym. I haven't been in quite a long time. Oh, it is bouncy. Look at that. Ooh. Uh, but I got sick and then I've been slowly recovering and blah, blah, blah. So I'm going easy on myself. Oh, I'm going easy on myself, but I would like to get back in there soon. But then I'm getting a tattoo hopefully finished on Thursday, so then it'll be a while before I can go back. Blah, blah, blah. Just need to, need to be kind to myself until I'm able to get back in there. That was a little pep talk from me to me there. Hope you enjoyed it. It's important to set realistic expectations. The Indomitable X says, off to work now for me. Catch you all on VOD Squad. Take care, the Indomitable X. And indeed, if you're watching this later, hello. I hope work was good. Whoop. Yes, great, 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 great. Emma Venton says, can someone give me a pep talk like that? Hell yeah. Emma, you're bloody brilliant. And you're a very caring person. And you know what? Sometimes life is is hard. And I get the impression that you are a person who is sometimes hard on themselves. Uh, it takes one to know one. But uh, you should extend to yourself the same grace and uh, 
the sense of empathy and forgiveness you extend to others because you are thoroughly deserving of it. You are brilliant and I'm very glad to have met you. So there. Fuck, that was a shit shot. <laughs> Carrie Choi, meanwhile, says, Emma, you should drink some water. <laughs> yeah. Go hydrate, goddammit. This goes not going brilliantly. Whoop. Whoop. Ow! Fuck off, everybody. Not you lot, obviously. Okay. I've definitely had better... Definitely a better runs than this, haven't I? Oh, shit. Yes! Yeah! That's what we want. Oh, num, 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 num. You gonna do any damage yet? The angry tomahawk's doing damage now. That's good. Help me, angry tomahawk. Yeah! Look at you go. Thanks, mate. Morbidorb. What does the Morbidorb do? It allows you to activate whatever that is. I don't know what that is, though. That's the problem. Let's get her a little, little reload. Lovely. Boink. Oh, here comes the rubber orb. Ah, Morbid Orb also triggers on spent pegs. Thank you. I think I just wasn't hitting any of them. Right. Christ alive. Okay, this, this one's going to refresh the board, which is great. Yeah! Crit. Lovely. Loved that. Oh, great. Best foot four warp. For fuck's sake. The first peg hit each shot gets plus five. Can target any en any enemy. I've not been doing selective targeting at all. Collateral ball damage. Convert every nine pegs hit to a bomb. Small torb. Right, we've got to heal. We've got to heal. Let's buy the best foot for for wob wob. Stephanie says, "Is this available on the Switch?" Oh God, I hope so in the future. Currently, it's in Steam early access, so I don't know if. I don't know. Let's uh, let's see what happens if we just do this. Oh, nothing good. Ow, <laughs> fucker! You know what? Let's do that. Why not? Uh, I hope it comes out on the Switch. As far as I'm aware, it isn't available. Cassandra Needham says, if I recall correctly, there is a Switch port planned. Yes, please. Mm. Gone to the shop. Not once. Well, no, only once have I fucking. Sorry about it, shop. Oh, that's pleasing. That sounds nice. Oh, God, if we go to the shop again, I'll be livid. Unless this is full of money? No. <gasps> beckoning crit! Like a cat beckoning cat. I like those little guys. Every 11 monies hit triggers a crit. Or Eye of Turtle. Orb and Relic Battle Rewards contain an additional option to choose from. Boring! Cat! Right, let's not go to the fucking shop. Dum, 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 dum. Unholy Glee says, oh, this on Switch would get played so much. I know, right? Decoy Orb. Enemies don't get their extra turns for your first reload. Okay. Or Refresh Yield. Refreshes the board on every reload. Let's get decoy orb. Bit of fun. Right. Now, yeah. Avoid the shop. Do, do, doom, doom, boom, doom, boom. Sorry. Uh, one sec. 
I'm street. I'm actually telling my friends about Peglin. Peglin, it's fucking great. Rogue like, but Peggle, and you are a goblin. Okay, Pebble. Quixotic Raven says, I'm a necky necko. I love those guys. We've got one in our kitchen, but uh, I think it needs a new battery because it's stopped waving. Uh, but it is good fun. And we've got a painting of one that's black, and the specific characters on its tummy are for uh, keeping evil spirits out, I'm told. So that's nice. My mother in law told me. Approvingly, actually. She was like, Good. No bad spirits. It's like, Yeah. And it's cute. Okay. There's a lot, there's a hell of a lot of enemies on this one, and the bombs are all sort of nestled away in there. Oh, a crit though. We don't hate that. Come on, kiss a bomb. Ah. Yeah, that's what we like to see. Let's clear the board. All right, and then refresh it. That was. A very pleasing go, I have to say. Get pecked. <laughs> it's still funny. So we can hit the old... Yes, we can activate the old. So you still pass through them, but you still get the points. That's great. Oh, lovely. Mmm. Zap. Lovely. Big fan of that one. Oh, we could buy a new pa Well, Bold Orb. Only hits enemies on the ground. Attack pierces all enemies. I want to buy the Bold Orb. Yeah. Bold Orb's gate, more like. Ha, ha, ha. Angel Beat says, Johnny, that was good. Thanks. I, occasionally I'll get it right. Tree people and bad snakes. All right, Pebble, let's fucking do this. Not really what I had in mind when I said, let's do this, but sure. <laughs> Orthogonal says, the bold orb doesn't really have a gate. It rolls. Love that. Great work. Big fan. Oh, hey, I quite... Ooh, that was good. Thanks, the wall. Um... Ah, you know what? Fuck it. I'll bring that up another time. Doesn't matter. I know that's one of the most annoying things when someone's like, hey, so... Actually, never mind. But it honestly doesn't matter. Uh... Boring admin shit that I can save for the end of the year. Oh no, the tree is just down. The tree is just down. No, the tree should be gone. Go away, tree. It's called deforestation, not reforestation. <laughs> Unholy Glee says, on my lunch break and Peglin has a demo. Uh-oh, uh-oh indeed. Um, I also, yesterday I installed and tried, what's it called? Die in the Dungeon Origins, which is like a free prequel for an upcoming game called Die in the Dungeon, which is uh, roguelike, and you place dice on a board. Um, it was good. I didn't love it. Oh, okay, it was dead. It was just on its, <laughs> on its, it's, it's faking death. Um, yeah, it, like it didn't grab me like this has, but I'm hope I don't know. Well, I might I might try it again and see. But I'd be interested to hear your thoughts uh, if anyone has played Die in the Dungeon. It's a free it's a free prequel game on uh, Steam, so you might as well have a go. I'm suspicious of this tree. I'll tell you that for nothing. Ah oh, bollocks. Ow! Well, 
and now hopefully we can fucking blow it up. Take that tree. Come on, blow up the tree, blow up the tree, blow up the tree. Nah, I didn't throw the bomb. All right. Issy Marie, uh, sorry, Issy Marie says, all right, I'm finally home. Time to go grab dinner, but I'll be back with you all shortly. No worries, you get comfy and you get yourself something nice to eat. It's good to get the steps in. You've earned it. Um, so much of the forest has turned against you, but one particular tree in this clearing feels like the last vestige of goodwill. You see an opportunity to take care of the tree and be taken care of in turn. Do we tend to the leaves and heal up? Tend to the roots and gain plus seven max HP or leave the clearing? Let's just tend to the roots. With your help, the tree's roots stretch out to cover new ground. You feel a deep sense of peace that persists after you leave the clearing. Lovely! And it healed us seven hit points, so that's nice. Let's go fight a slime. <laughs> who MD says, uh, sorry, who MD 21 says, had to walk the dog. How much pegging did I miss? So much. Right. Best foot fall, fall wood. Not bad. Not bad at all. Ow. Boom. Creature. Come on, hit lots and lots of pecs, please. Great. Ow. Well, that's good if we can activate that bomb. And also get the reload. And a crit. Eh, it's all right. Nessie says, oh, stream's still happening. Yeah, I'm going to go until 8 p.m., I think. It's been a while since I've managed a full four-hour stream. And you know what? I'm in a good mood. I've got the energy to do it. This game's great. We're having a nice time. Why not, eh? Why not? Ah, Angry Tomahawk. Glad to see you're finally doing some fucking damage. Thanks for the reload. Ba -ba. And a bomb. Womp. I think this thing is going to swallow us before we kill it. So that'll be fun for it. Crete. Reload. Crete. Okay. Hannah says, just arrived and I'm glad to hear we're having a nice time. We're having a lovely time. <gasps> it's the bold orb. This is uh, Peglin. It's it's flipping brilliant. Big fan. Oh, the bald orb is big, but not like... It was pretty big, I guess. Oh, no, that was pretty cool. Okay, all right, I take it all back. Ah, the reorganizer. All right, reorganizer, reorganize this. Thanks. Oh, we're kind of taking some lumps here. That's not a great time to be activating the... the this one, whatever it's called. But hey-ho, you know what? It's okay. Uh, let's see. Let's let's put a crit on that. Oh, meah. Oh dear. Normally this boss, so far anyway, hasn't given us this much trouble. But uh, here we are, inside a big orb that is a uh, big slime guy that's hurt hurtful. It doesn't help that I think we need to actually bust out from here because look at all this stuff delicious treats on the other side of the, the big slime. The big slime sounds like a nightmare city. You going to the big smoke? No, mate, the big slime. That's where the real fun is. Ooh. Okay, it's dead. Cool, never mind. Ex Exas Orb 8. Brilliant. Increases hit enemies, debuffs by one, can target any enemy. Illu circle. Should we get some ball illusion? <laughs> uh, Splatorb. You know what? Let's get some fucking ball illusion. Why not? Let's get it. Splatorb. No, no. Should we upgrade an orb? Yeah, I like the ether wheel. There we go. We've upgraded it. A relic. Wand of Skultimate Greed. Uh, no. Sphere Day's Fate. Summons a round squirrel onto the pegboard whenever 30 pegs are hit, but is destroyed after 100 uses. Well, it sounds like we're going to be getting that one because it sounds hilarious. Um, 
Kinetic Meteorite, every three pegs hit provides explosive force until the board is refreshed. Glorious Suffer Ring. All attacks have minus two slash minus three, but every peg activated gets upgraded plus two damage. No. Let's take the Spheridae's Fate. There we go. Hooray! See the little peglin dancer did there? That was nice. Forest complete. All right, the boss is the big Imhotep wall of sand that ate us last time, so let's do what we can, everyone. Let's fight some bricks. And yes, I said bricks. Go on, hit the crit. I dare you. Nice. <laughs> A respectable first outing, I think. It's got a pebble orb or whatever it's called. What are they called? Pebble. That's right. Pebble orb. Ooh, cheeky. Okay, all right. Okay, we're in a mild amount of danger and or trouble, but the rub orb is absolutely cleaning up here. There's the squirrel that happened. That we get when we hit oh my god so many squirrels that's nice get fucked that was 400 damage in one go through the power of squirrels apparently Andrew Roberts says Aoife will watch Johnny we're in suspense I don't know what I said to make you say that but it's not the first time someone's made that joke this stream. I don't know what I'm saying. Thunder Cookie says, wait, we squirrel every 30 pegs? Awesome. Yes. Exactly. Also, I love video games. Because you get to say things like, we squirrel every 30 pegs. And people go, no way. Holy shit, that's brilliant. Here comes the reorganizer. Oh, ether wheel. Right. Understood. Oh, E for Will. Got it. Right, right, right. Which shows you just about what I think of that one. It's all right. That's an, all, that's a, that's an okay gag. Yeah, go squirrel. It's your... Oh, Christ. Yeah, that squirrel didn't do so, do so well. We're getting our asses kicked this time. Feels like the, the build isn't, isn't brilliant. Come on. Come on, mouse. Why can't I aim higher? I go oh, it's just, it's really big, so it's got a smaller aim. I don't want to say circle, but you know what I mean. Yes, yes, yes. Now hit the bomb. Now hit the crit. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, go squirrel. Oh my god, squirrel. Holy shit. Oh, these guys are toast. Couple of bombs. Enormous boulder. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, let's heal up. Because that's necessary. And then what have we got here? A mega orb. Oh, wow. Bloody hell. Thanks, Wes. Wesley Harkup has done a super chat uh, that reads, Dead dog in an alley, which may not make a lot of sense to you, but if you're from Newcastle and you like obscure folk, it's dead dog in an alleyway. Thanks, Wes. How are you doing? Uh, this is Peglin. Uh, it's in early access on Steam, so it's not out on consoles yet, but hopefully it fucking will be, because it's brilliant. It's like Peggle, but you're a goblin. Uh, do I want any of these? Two's Company. That's a good one. I'll take that. Um, 626 Games says, hey, I made it back before I ended chat, lol. Um... Uh, yeah, we're we going for another hour and ten minutes. Northern Bass says, isn't it also a Watchman quote? Is it? Hmm. Shows what I know. Silent Cobb has done a super sticker of three hippopotamuses. Three hippopotamumai? Three hippos. Kind of popping up from a little green lake and waggling their little ears about. It's cute. Thank you very much, Silent Cobb. Special button. The ball will contain one additional crit marker. Sure. Uh, or enhanced gunpowder. Activate nearby pegs when detonated. Let's take the special button. 
Alex Simkin has summoned the blood pair. If you imagine a pear, you know, the piece of fruit, it's the first line from Rorschach's journal. Oh. Huh. Interesting. Um, Alex, so basically, if you imagine a pear and then give it arms, legs, and a face, uh, and then give it a mug that's full of a viscous red fluid, which is uh, suspicious, uh, that's what we're looking at here. Thank you very much, Alex. Uh, let's scoop up the forge. Again, let's, yeah, let's get the perfect forger. Whenever an orb is yammy, yammy, yammy. Great. Cool. Uh, oh, Christ. I would like to avoid the shop, if I may. Yeah, there we go. Let's have a big fight. All right. Let's see. So up here we've got a man with a shield that's got 80 health, he's got 200 health, man with a sword and 200 health, some sort of wazard and an archer with 200 health. We need to get stuck in on this one, I, I suspect. Fuck it, let's do it. Grease. Yeah, go squirrel. Reload the board, don't hate that. Ugh. Well, it took out his shield. Ow! Fuck off, wizard. And archer. Ah, not my best. Me Thrill has done a super sticker. A lot of super stickers flooding in over the last few minutes. Uh, the super sticker is of a peach, but... Uh, the thing about this peach is, if you take a close look, uh, there's something about the shape of it, and also the way it is lit, uh, that make it look like a human butt. Which is uh, suggestive and, and and delightful. Thank you very much, Mithril. Fuck off, you big sword bastard. Ah! Oh my god, that guy's huge! We're in trouble this, this run, I have to say. It's not... We've had better. Snorpin Bass says, that music is both adorable and badass at the same time. I kind of like it. It feels like the chill, easy listening music version of Baby Metal. I know what you mean. I, I genuinely know what you mean on that. This is not good. Oh, oh I dodged. Thanks, Borlusion. Ow. Uh, okay. What's this one do? It applies double damage slime to every nine pegs hit. Great. Go on, set the bomb off. Yes! That'll help. A creed. And a reload. Okay. I'd sincerely love it if the bomb had taken out that swordsman, but oh well. We could live through this, yeah. Oh god, no, he just buffed all of my enemies. Why did I have to say something? Shit. Oh, no. Now we're absolutely... Oh, okay, all right. Okay. We're not absolutely fucked. Okay, the angry tomahawk's doing great bits now, so let's get a crit on that. Crit and a reload. We don't hate it. We must be due a squirrel soon, they said in a perfectly understandable sentence. Hollis Wood says, kill the wizard. Ah, yes. I forgot I can target enemies, can't I? Ooh, that's such overkill for an enemy with 37 health. Look at that. Wham. Fuck off, wizard. Okay. Pebble bollocks. Can't target the wizard with uh, a pebble, can we? Unless we can. I don't think we can. Because there are some orbs that specifically say, target any enemy. Yes, there we go. Ow! Stop healing them, you shitlord! 
absolute Montebank. Oh, come on, come on. Let me get this aim right. Eh. Eh. No, not really good enough. Crap. Nessie has done a super sticker of the lemon person. If you imagine a somebody had a lemon for a head, and then their entire body was the same sort of yellowy, slightly waxy uh, exterior, that's sort of what we're talking about right now. And then imagine that they're kind of doing a little boogie to themselves. That's oh no. That's that's who we're that's who we're discussing right now. Fuck. Come on, need this to do loads and loads of damage, please. No. That wasn't terrible. But really, I think we're fucked here. I think we're absolutely dished. Set off a bomb. Nah, fucked. We gave it a good go. That was not a good build. It's you know what, which actually feels quite nice in that that's the first time I've I've been like, oh, ooh, like it, I I don't feel like the orbs I had were very. Th there was no synergy. Let's go back to the forest. Let's go hack up some slimes, shall we? An apple a day increases your max health by fifteen. Oh, cookie. Let's, let's have an apple. Angel Beat has summoned the blood pair. It's like I described it earlier. If you imagine a pair, but, but it has sentience, arms, legs, and a face. Cartoonish, freakish even. And then it has a mug. Absolutely brimming with a viscous red fluid. That's what it is. Vaguely terrifying. Right, let's get some pebbles in there. Who MD21 says, ew, apples. Well, you would say that, wouldn't you, Who MD21? They're your biggest competitor. Ew, apples. Classic, classic MD talk, innit? Oh, you're all boned. I'm throwing two bombs. Bye! Oh, you're doing all right. Oh, you weren't on the board. Yeah, that's why. Okay. Come on, hit a crit, me little dagger. Yes! That's what we like to see. All right, now you're both fucked. Great. Oh, no, you're all right. Oh, I was convinced I'd won that, that round. Okay, well, that's all right. We keep going. Go on, hit the crit, be funny. Oh, fine, suit yourself. Okay. Whoop. Whoop. Right, there we go. Fight one. Let's see now. Ooh, what are you? Oh my gorb! Destroys any peg it hits, attacks all enemies. It does a... They're permanently removed from the pegboard. It does do a lot of damage. But do we want that this early doors? Hmm. Uh, 626 Games has done a super chat saying, I played this for only a short time, but I dare say they make it much more interesting. Uh, thanks for being awesome and providing many hours of fun. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. Um... Oh, let's have the instigate orb. After attacking with this orb, the next orb fire will attack all enemies. I like the sound of that. I'm not going to buy the Oh My Gorb, also because I can't now. Let's save our money a little bit. Let's push on. Okay. Um. Oh, did you mean they make it much, much more interesting as I do? Well, that's a nice thing to say. Unless I'm wrong, in which case, wow. That's bigoted, that bigoted conceited of me. Uh, but thank you very much for the Super Chat 626 games. Doing. Well, hey! Oh, fighting trees again. They're big and it's alarming. 
Emma Benton says, Johnny, have you played Don't Nod's new game? Just Ant, I think, was the name. No, I haven't. Um, how is it? Is it good? Oh, good, I got it right. Thank you, 626 Games. Okay, right. Let's see how much more damage we're doing with the Instigate Orb. Not loads. Oh, no, that's right. It hits both. That's great. Yeah, that is great. Big fan of the Instigate Orb. It was good stressful for someone who doesn't like heights, though, lol. <laughs> oh, is it? Um, I'm trying to think if I've seen screenshots of it or not. Oh, I'm going to get hit by a tree. Oh, they don't hit it very hard. That's all right. I thought it was going to do me absolutely massive damage then. Well, hey! I love a reload. Oh, poor, poor little tree all curled up. I do feel kind of bad about that. Something about this particular piece of music reminds me of Point Blank, the arcade game, which I loved so much. I had it on PlayStation, I had some GCOM 45s, and I just spent countless hours playing it. To the point where uh, it was at EGX one year and I was playing it and a guy challenged me. He was like, I'll take you on. I was like, okay. Um, oh my God, what was wrong with me? Oh, it's fine. Uh, and I schooled him so hard, he threw his gun down, turned to me and went, fuck you in my face. And I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's great. Uh, Jusant. I'm going to Google Jusant. Jusant. Action puzzle climbing game in a meditative journey. Well, that sounds delightful. Scale an immeasurably tall tower. One of the year's best gems. Oh, that does look fun. All right, yeah. I'll oh, have, a, have a go on that. Hey, why says, Christ, point blank. Admittedly, I was more for time crisis. Still, wow. So I had time crisis as well, which was great. But point blank was uh, my real favourite. Infernorb, yeah, 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 Swaltorb, yeah, yeah. let's get the Spinfectious Sting, why not? I don't like Dagorb very much. Let's, fuck it, let's get Swaltorb. It's just nice to have more orbs, isn't it? Oh, it's just Anton Game Pass. Well, in that case, I will have a, have a bang on it. Elna Smith says, speaking of puzzles, did you ever finish Chance of Senna? No, I had that classic thing where you open a game and then go, Muh? and then don't touch it again. So uh, I really should get back to it. But I did not. Right. Sword slimes, are we? Well, let's fire some bombs at you then. Or not. Or not. Mr. Tom for the Wind says, I wish light guns worked on modern TVs and monitors because I still play that shit all the time. I know, I know. Um... You know what was actually really good, and I'm, I'm sad that they didn't make more of it, was um, Link's crossbow training on the Wii. I loved that. I had the plastic, like, me, 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 me thing, which, which helped. Um, but yeah, just... I'm playing like absolute shit right now. Like, this next go's got to be big. Um, I thought it was brilliant. Next guy's got to be big. It's not going to be big. Fuck this. <laughs> but it did hit everyone, so that's nice. Come on, throw a bomb. Boo. I'm going to get through this, but it's not going to be pretty. Come on, throw the fucking... Oh. Dreadful. Right. Up yours, Dagorb. There we go. Duplicate orb. Duplicates hit things and things one time. Yeah, fuck it. We'll take a duplicate orb. Why not? Fernando Perez says, I saw a video of a game that will launch tomorrow while the iron's hot. Apparently you're a blacksmith that learns everything from the beginning. While the iron's hot. Game. 
Hmm. Step into the boots of a journeyman blacksmith. Oh, this is cute. There's a demo. Well, well, well. I might check that out. Oh, it does look cute. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Interesting. Um, Bright Spark has done a super chat saying my usual D&D game got cancelled tonight, but on the bright side, I get to catch a stream live. Way. Guess I'll just have to resort to Baldur's Gate for my D&D fix. There you go. We're still adventuring here in, in Peglin, which is all about being a little peg blasting goblin. Oh, excuse me. Bright Spark, thank you so much for the super chat. I'm sorry to hear about D&D &D getting cancelled. Uh, it's always rubbish, especially since the hardest part of D&D &D is trying to find a time when everyone is free. Right, this tree is nice. Let's t take tend to the tree leaves. We have been healed. Hooray. Blue Paw has done their first ever super chat on a live stream. It's actually a super sticker. Uh, it is the pear. The pear has put down its mug of possibly blood and instead it's put on a party hat and has like a party blower and is kind of going and doing like a little party dance left and right, which is very, very cute. Thank you very much, Blue Paw. Pocket sand. I'm so happy. That's a King of the Hill reference. When an enemy hits you with a melee attack, apply blind 10 to that enemy. That's great. Yeah, let's take that. Give it a 10% chance to miss on subsequent attacks. Yes, please. Right, let's see which way we're going. I'll leave it entirely up to physics. Another chest, is it? <laughs> Puppet. Prevent the first time you would lose health each battle. Pretty great. Or ball peen hammer. Whenever one of those is created, gain four ball walk. Let's take that. Because hopefully then we can get the ball walk, whatever it is, ball. The ball cler, I think it's called. Uh, and unlock a new class. I doubt it, but... You encounter a weathered old peglin flipping a poker chip. Yeah, hell yeah, let's uh, let's flip the chip. You lose the flip, and it, it's happy as it... Oh, you can flip again? Sure, fuck it, why not? Ow! I'm leaving. Eleanor Smith says I do like the face of the sock, though. Yeah, that puppet was pretty cute. But hey, we've done it now. All right. Let's go, fuckers. <laughs> Oh, I really feel like this game was going great for me for a couple of runs, and now I feel like it's, it's, what am I doing wrong? I'm not peggling like I used to, you know? Whoop, yeah. Yeesh. I should do better than that. Stop reloading. Is it S Kirk Ridge X or is it Skirk Ridge X? It says that's just the way the peglin goes. Yeah. True that. Whoop, whoop, whoop. A bomb? No, no bomb. No, I'm going to fucking try and throw one next turn, though. There's a bat on my doorstep. Fuck it, let's try it. No, no, I hit anything but the bomb. Bullshit. Skirk Ridge EX technically, but close, as in Street Fighter EX plus Alpha. Ah, oh, good to know. Can't believe it was the EX bit I fell down on. Please set the bomb off. Yeah! There we go. That's more bloody like it. Lovely. Should be able to wade through the rest of these comfortably now. In theory, at any rate. Okay. Oh, yeah, we've... I forgot we added blinds to that one. Was that not the instigate orb? Oh, damn, I thought it was. Oh, well. oh, it was. Brilliant. 
Fantastic. Issy Mary says, uh, had food, feel less like I need to cry. I'm kind of back both mentally and physically. We love to hear of a redemption arc. Um, very glad that you're feeling more yourself. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't realise that you were, um, you were, you were feeling like you might need to cry. Um, also, do it if you wanna. Or do it if you have to. It's cathartic and good for you. Haha, <laughs> you missed. Um, but yeah, um, very glad you're, you're feeling on a more even keel. What is this? Summoning circle? Summons one copies of the next orb in your deck. Hmm. Could be good, could be, could be bad. Investigate orb again. I love the investigate orb is the problem. You know what? I'm going to get it. And you know what? Might upgrade it. No. No, I won't. <laughs> it's not that good. Let's heal. Great. Oh, he says, not going to lie, I didn't realise it either. It's weird, that, isn't it? Some days you're just like, no! But it's not until later you realise how, how done you are with the day in general. Okay, we start with an instigate orb. And the instigate orb uh, is followed by a dag orb, so we want to keep this crit symbol alive if we may. So that we can massively increase the damage we're dealing to everybody. Here it comes. If it'll let me aim properly. Oh, it moved! Oh, why didn't I see that it moved? Oh, Johnny, you absolute dickhead. Ah, I could have could have just gone there. Bollocks. Well, we've got another instigator orb, so that's okay. I guess. Oh, rubbish. Absolute, absolute rubbish. Doesn't feel like a, a great run RNG-wise either, in terms of the orbs I've got. Although, a lot of that's down to the ones I've chosen. Okay, let's do a cheeky reload. A bomb, we don't hate to see it. Get fucked, this particular slime. Okay. This feels like overkill now, because uh, that plant's nearly dead, but dead it is properly. Great, we lived. Taking a lot of damage this turn, though. Got a heal again, I think. Oh, what are you? Balestra. Ball Estra. Got it. Gain grants one muscle circle when fired. Grants one muscle circle to all enemies when fired. Oh, I don't know about that. Let's buy it. Ah, <laughs> oh, we do have fun. That was tactically unwise. But we've done it anyway. Dum, ba, dum, dum. Duplicate orb, that's right. I should have tried to hit something with the duplicate orb, but oh well. Here comes the pebble orb, or whatever it's called. Pebble, pe pebble. Why can't I remember the fucking name of that thing? <laughs> little bit hung up on trying to hit those two bombs actually so I should probably stop it quit that fucking nonsense uh, well you know what I might do that let it just run down there stop pelting me horrible bastard Way we got a bomb out. Brilliant. Oh, I feel like the spirit of, of 
Peglin has left me. I feel like I was on a real tear earlier. Even with one in a circle. Oh, goodness me. No! <laughs> Holliswood says, you're going to get et again. I am getting et. What's happened to me? I'm all washed up. Oh, fuck off. Dreadful. Absolutely dreadful. What's all this it's got? Oh, okay, it's got a 50% chance of missing me, despite the fact I'm in its tummy. That feels better. Nah, this run's fucked. Absolutely banjaxed. Dreadful. Oh, Peglin, I failed you. You delightful little goblin. Awful. Happy Bob says, Johnny, your streams are both entertaining, but also great for having on while sleeping. It's my spe It's my specialty. Enjoyable even when you're unconscious. Wait, no, that sounded fucking wrong. Sorry. Uh, enjoyable even when you're sleeping. King Kartoffel says, really drop the ball on that one. Too soon, King Kartoffel. New game. Right, we can do this. A wheel of cheese? Oh, bad cheese. Deal 20 times the number of reloads damage to all enemies when reloading. That sounds great. Fresh bandana. The board will... No. Navigation inflation. Every... Eh. No. Bad cheese. All right, here we go. Hello, trees. It's like a really low-budget recreation of the Battle of Isengard. There you go. 626 Games says, That's them. Soothing one moment, then making you choke on your snack with laughter the next. I'm nothing if not wildly inconsistent. <laughs> what? What? Not a terrible one. Not my bust. All right, we're good. That tree's gonna get it. And this tree should take 20 damage when we reload because of the bad cheese. Oh, wow. There it did. Oh, that's interesting. That's why the tree is, is there. I tried to attack that tree and it blocked it. So I've got to wait for this tree to come up to me before I can actually start damaging it. That's worrying. Pietro P says, if you mind a suggestion, that cheese relic seems to work best with a small deck. Of course! Of course it would! Oh, Pietro, that's smart. <laughs> Hannah says, it's like Darkest Dungeon, you have to clear the corpses first. God, I love Darkest Dungeon. I need to get back to playing the second one. What I like about it is that it it's not one of those games where I'm like, oh, I've not played it in ages, I need to start again. Specifically Darkest Dungeon 2. The first Darkest Dungeon I've restarted like three times because I've not played it in ages and I feel like I need to get, you know, start again and blah, 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 which is why I've never finished it. Reload. You died because of cheese. What is this? Cobanorb. Cobanorb. Cobanorb? Like the Copacabana? Boliviation. Circuito. Circuit. Circuit. Activate Torb. Nope. Let's just upgrade. Dagorb. I'm going to try and keep my deck low. Oh, I didn't need to heal. Oh, well. No, we're not going to the bloody shop. Ah, oh, I could have taken a pebble, pe a pebble out. 
Ah oh, well. You live and learn. Oh, corn cobs, says Angel B. Yeah, that sounds more, more likely. You find a waterfall just off the path. What secrets might it be hiding? Check behind the waterfall, obviously. There's nothing behind the waterfall, and when you emerge, there's a strong monster waiting for you. That's bullshit. <laughs> I love I love the waterfall fallacy in a video game. Because if there's something behind the waterfall... Oh my god, that's so reductive. Like how obvious is something behind the waterfall? And if you check behind the waterfall and there's nothing there, it's like, what fucking bullshit? What fucking nonsense is this? I went all the way behind the waterfall. Why am I not being rewarded? You know? Right. Pebble, pebble, pebble. Okay. Pebble bulb. Pebble bulb. Pebble. We've reached the repeating nonsense words to myself phase of the stream. Feels like it's been a while since we've had one of those, so uh, welcome back to that. Emma Benton, I'm not reading that out, but it's very funny. Oh, look at this big, big little slime over here. Aw, cute. Alright, yeah. Actually, no, that's fine. Whack. Thunder Cookie says the game said one strong monster, but I count several. I know, what gives? Come on, make this big crit, please. No, fucked it. Meh, but meh. Meh. I hate it. And then a reload, so 20 damage to everyone. Lovely, lovely. What an incredible overkill for a six health monster. Okay. Yep, alright, we don't hate it. Sure, why not? Okay, great. Oh, don't you eat me, you little fucking... You rude green bastard. Oh, no! Come on! Something better. Anonymous says, okay, you're gonna catch the last bit on VOD. Time for me to go to bed. Go to bed! Sleep well, Anonymous. It's lovely having you in chat, as usual. I hope you're all right. Um, thank you for tuning in. And if you're watching this on VOD, welcome back, hello. Hannah says, oh, big green slime looks so worried. I know. Ellen Smith says, okay, gang, uh, I've got to run and get something to eat. Catch the rest on VOD. Take care. You convert that food into chemical energy. It's important for your body. Listen to what it wants. Um, and yeah, thank you very much for being in chat. Ooh, that was good. Enjoyed that. Right, let's get a nice crit. Oh, fuck off. Ooh, 10 points of damage there. Rubbish. Ugh. Oh, no. Okay, well, we killed it with reload, so that's nice. Multi-ball, reorganizer. Let's get ball lightning. Come on, we're not made of wood. Should we, up we could upgrade ball lightning. We should heal. We took a lot of damage there. Thanks, waterfall. Thanks for nothing. Am I right? Ax me anything, for fuck's sake. Enemy damage resistances become weaknesses instead. Not bad. Short stack. Attacks gain plus one, minus one, uh, minus one, plus one for e every blat on the board. No. Uh, smoke mod. Let's take ax me anything. It's a great pun. Becca Wilton says, never felt so motivated to go and make dinner. Hey, look, I do feel like part of my job is driving people away from my streams to go and get on with things that are good for them. You know? Cam says, evening all, I am here just when I planned to be. Yes, Cam! Good for you. It's nice to see you. How are you doing? This is Peglin 
It's great. I was playing, I like to think, quite well earlier. That is no longer necessarily the case. This run's going okay. Actually, this particular run is... This particular fight is going quite well. That's why. We've got a few more slimes to get through, though, before we're done with this here fight. So, ugh, a reload wouldn't go amiss. Or a refresh, or whatever they call it, when you add put, put peg back on board go. That's what I mean. Yeah, one of them. There we go. Lovely. Thank you. Emma Benton says, yes, I almost exclusively come here to be yelled at about my water consumption or lack thereof. You're an edge case, Emma, I would like to think. I think it's partly because... I think partly because whenever people mention water, you go, pfft, water. <laughs> Which I admire and respect, just for the record. Great, that was easy. Or bust. Or bust. Like robust? Or bust? Uh, grants one must circle when fired. Grants two bulwark when fired. I don't hate it. Let's buy it. Why not? Could have healed then, but didn't. What is this? Highway Aubrey. Fucking hell. Good lord. Emma Benton says I have a full water bottle. Thank you. Well, there you go. Some clever clogs is about to point out that if it's full, it's because you've not drunk it. But that's... I'm not saying that. I'm getting ahead of them. I'm cutting them off at the pass. You're doing fine, mate. You're all good. Don't even worry about it. There it is, Hannah Axelson. Should it be full? That means you haven't drunk any, right? Beep. Called it. Carry choices. I was going to say that, Johnny. Yeah, yeah. Colin Laster says if it's full, you're not drip. Thank you, Johnny. Eh? I know how you all think. One day I'm going to hunt you all for sport. <laughs> <sighs> that made me laugh. I'm mostly joking. I'm probably not going to hunt you all for sport. That would be tiring. Yeah, you were all thinking it. Emma says, I'm sorry, you're going to what? Hunt you all for sport. I'm not saying like lethally. I'm just saying like, you know, hunt you all for sport a little bit. Oh, that was a, that was a good bloody round. Alex Hansen says, yeah, it won't be just for sport. Gotta eat what you kill, right? Hey, oh, I mean, no comment. Mm. Oh, I've got no money, so we won't be buying any of these. Okay. Uh, fight or question mark? Let's try question mark. You encounter a weathered old peglin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flip the chip, baby. Flip the chip, baby. Flip the chip, baby. Ow! Flip the chip, baby. This is bad. Flip the chip. Yay. <laughs> well, I shouldn't have done that. Took a lot of damage there. All right. You find another peglin intensely surveying the area. Hello, I'm Haglin. Have we met before? I'm afraid I haven't quite set up shop here yet, but in the meantime, I can offer you a free sample. Haglin. Very good. What can I do for you? Upgrade an orb? Remove an orb. Get rid of my fucking pebble. Ooh, new inventory. Haglin squeals while taking the pebble off your hands. You wonder just how many orbs Haglin has collected. Hmm. Okay. J.P. Pittman. That's a strong name. J.P. Pittman. This is your first ever super chat, J.P. Saying, finally caught you live. Just crawled out of bed here in Aussie land. Here's a small thank you for years of entertainment. Thank you. That is very, very kind. Um, you're very bloody welcome for, for said years of entertainment. Uh, I feel very lucky that I get to do this as my job. Um, uh, and it's important to keep hold oh no it's important to keep hold of that sometimes oh that's how we get these little multiply guys it's the it's the chip um 
it's you know it's important to bear that in mind sometimes because like like any like any job it can be difficult and I can have difficult weeks and blah 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 but really I am very lucky to be doing what I do and I'm very grateful to everyone who enjoys it um, and to those who hate watch <laughs> oh that's gone well that's gone well for me Come on, double my damage. Double my da- Yes! Absolutely massive overkill. We love to see it. Right, all we got to do is chuck a bomb and we're home free. They said, failing to do just that. King Cartoffle says, views are views. I know, right? Sometimes I will get the odd comment. It's like, I've watched every episode of this and I've hated it. It's been like, great, thanks. Alex Hansen says, are there any hate watchers in chat you have to own up? <laughs> yeah, come on. It's a hate watch amnesty. If you absolutely hate my guts, just say it now. And uh, you know what? That's absolutely fine. Hate watchers, where you at? Bam! Uh, okay. How are we looking? We should heal. Rub orb. Elu circle. Pollution is pretty useful. Fuck it, yeah. Fuck it. Why not? <sighs> okay. Oh, fuck off. Wait. No! <laughs> oh, that actually went okay, weirdly. Enter. Take a relic. Reduce, refuse, recycle. Very good. Bombs detonated while navigating provide five monies. Meh. Or bomb baton. Pegboard start with plus three bombs. Oh, we'll be taking that, I think. Oh, the door is going. That's fun. Watson's going bananas. As you can probably hear, the door is shut. Uh, I'm still streaming with the door closed in case Luna comes in and poops all over my office again. I uh, don't know why the door's going, but I don't have to go get it. So there it goes again. All right. All right, Pebble, let's dance. Crit this thing. And a bomb. Oh, delicious. That first bug is going down. All the way down. 312 damage. Delightful. Messi says, the way is shut. <laughs> Enjoyed that. All right, let's try and get ourselves some ballusion. Which sounds like collusion, but with balls. I'm, uh, oh, I'm absolutely due a Lord of the Rings rewatch at some point. I uh, took the plunge um, and bought the 4K... Uh, extended edition box how 4k extended edition box set of uh, of the Lord of the Rings films on blu-ray I've never actually seen all of the extended editions I don't actually think I've seen one of them all the way through I've seen half of the two towers extended edition I've never watched the other one so that's gonna be a treat for me What's it still having a go at the door Chill out, Watson. She can't hear me. Why am I even talking to her? I mean, I love her. That's why I'm talking to her, but you know what I mean. Yeah, see, some of the bank shots. I, tr I was trying to skim it over that one. That would have worked in Peggle. Not in... Not in Peglin. All right, let's get some bulwark on our butts. And we're firing a bomb. That's great. This is going to do fuck all damage. Bollocks. But the bomb is good. Okay, great. All right, we're, we're getting there. Oh, we, we managed. Oh, because we reloaded and killed it. Great. Double-edged sorb. 
for fuck's sake. When drawn, deal self damage equal to the number of popped pegs. No thanks. You do great damage, but I'm not. I'm not messing around with that. Uh, if this all bait, very weak regular attack, massive damage on crit can target any enemy. Let's take it. Let's take it. It's like the dag orb, but you can attack any enemy. I like it. Let's go. And then let's. Try for the question, Mirk. Oh. I said, let's try for the question, Mirk. I said. Let's. Thank you. In the woods, yes! Reach into, no, just shake the tree. Ba -ba. An egg, we have an egg. All right, it's time for big enemy. Why is the door going so much? I understand not. Oh, what's this unhappy? Bless her, I love her so much. When she whines like that, she sounds like a dolphin being electrocuted. Or how I imagine that to sound, I hasten to add. All right, bombs are hey. A hey? Bombs are hey. <sighs> bombs away. I meant to say bombs ahoy, but that's not it either. Emma Benton says, how would you know what that sounds like? I don't, but I, it's how I imagine it to sound. What happened there? What, did, what happened? What did I do? What did I throw? I do not understand what I just did. All right, then. I hope it's something good and cool, like someone sent us both a present. If uh, the door's going to go off that much. Oh, that was the egg that I threw. I threw an egg. That's right, in these trying times. Thank you, Orthognolus. All right, let's try and get ourselves some Ballusion. Looking pretty good. Ballusion, baby! Wham! Okay, now this one we can aim at any enemy, but really we just want to keep attacking this one, let's face facts. Oh, we wanted to get the Crete. Oh, fuck. Fuck off, fuck off. That was wank. That was absolute dog shit. Wonder if that 11 year old's still watching. <laughs> Hello! <gasps> yes! Oh, fuck off. Okay, two bombs will do it. Yeah! Oh, Backlob. Do we want the buckle orb? Laser orb. Fires with huge force. Extra bouncy, low gravity. One sec. Um... Jack-o'-lantern orb. Meh. Meh. Ah, meh. No, we need to heal. Take relic. A good slime. Whenever slime is applied to peg, it gets upgraded plus two. No, peg bag. Ball will contain two additional refresh things. Salt shaker. When you would ingrid... Let's take the peg bag. Erect. Erect. Wink. Let's go fighting. Oh, I didn't. That was a big boss one. What did I just fight? Well, my memory's shot, apparently. Well, hey, it's crit time. Ah. <laughs> uh <laughs> Oh, it's been a while since I've streamed for four full hours. 
So uh, that's how you end up with things like, well, hey, it's crit time. Which, in fairness, I think more people should yell during during games of Dungeons and Dragons, but that's just me. Oh, go on, yes. Absolutely wrecked. Destroyed them all. Right, heal up again. I'm not going to buy anything unless it's really good, because I'm trying to keep my... No, wait, hang on a minute. Is this even the reload one? It is. Yeah, the bad cheese. Yeah, I'm going to... Yeah. Minorisu has done a super chat saying they're still going. Go, Johnny. Hell yeah. I decided I wanted to keep uh, streaming because I like this game and uh, streaming feels good at the moment. It feels really good. Not that it ever feels like bad, but like there are times when I'm like, oof, three hours is enough. And then there are some days where I'm like, no, I'm going to keep this up. I've been thinking about maybe like exploring different ways I could stream, like, uh, this is what I was going to bring up earlier and then I was like, you know what, I can't be asked. Um, I've been wondering like, what percentage of my audience also watches streams on Twitch, whether there's a platform they prefer, basically like whether I should give Twitch streaming a go. Uh, and I think that would probably be an as well rather than instead of YouTube. Because it means that I can try slightly different things. Like, for example, you know, like on Twitch, there's a lot of people who are like, I'm a this game streamer. Whereas I am obviously very much a variety streamer. But sometimes it's quite nice to sink your teeth into a game and be like, we're going to be back playing this. It's low stakes. You know, like, it's this game that you can see me play, you know, basically any time. So I don't have to explain it to you and yada, yada, yada. You know, like, I'm just curious. Mr. Tom for the Wind says, come Twitch stream with me. Hey, i got to shoot my shot. See, this is the thing. Like, um, I really like the, you know, the raiding mechanic. And it feels like there's a much, there's a whole, like, there's a big fucking audience on Twitch that, like, I am, um, funnily enough, not tapped into. And I'm like, would it be worthwhile? I don't know. So I think what I'm going to do towards the end of the year, I'm going to put out like a Google survey to all my patrons slash in general, just being like, hey, do you watch my stuff? <laughs> if you watch my stuff, where do you watch it? Does where you watch it matter to you? Is this, you know, blah, 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 blah. Um, basically, my audience for the last 15 years has been on YouTube. So I'm going to stick with YouTube. Certainly, you know, where all the Patreon stuff goes. I think this, ah, I'm being et again. Where all of, you know, the streaming schedule I have here really works, but I don't know. There may be the slightly ad hoc nature of Twitch. I think it kind of appeals to me, so I might give it a go. Um, Shaws the Great and Powerful, aka P Noctum, uh, has done a super chat saying, Can you tell me to get my butt in gear and study so I can actually write my essay that's due on Sunday? Apparently, telling myself isn't working. Listen, Shaws, I'm not going to bullshit you. You're going to get this thing done because you can't or not. Right? Like, not handing it in is not an option. However, what I want you to think about is how you're going to feel once you've handed it in. Are you going to feel like you just scraped in over the line? Like you only just got that done? That's how I felt about a lot of my essays when I was at university. And you know what? I regret that. I think more than anything is not giving myself more of a chance and more time to just fucking engage with the work I'm doing. Um... So procrastination, don't get me wrong. I mean, I became a journalist because I procrastinate. So having a, a very short deadline really, really works for me. But you you know and I know it's going to be so much more fulfilling if you just start putting in work now. Yeah, no? You should probably get on it. Maybe try getting your butt in gear. Let's see. So... Looking at Twitch and YouTube chat. You need to do 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 Interesting. All right. Well, I might give it a go just because I think like I like the to claim the things and the and the ra raiding people. I think is a really lovely thing. I wish they had it on YouTube. Twitch does have an annoying advertising mechanic. Yeah. I, th I think it would, to put any everyone's mind at ease, it would have to be something enormous for me to pick up this whole thing from YouTube and fuck off to Twitch. That's not happening. Uh, you know, I've built my audience here and 
like god just oh he's getting old and lazy <laughs> but i'm intrigued by it i'm in i'm intrigued by it. i might i might dally um i might have a i might have a little little play around with twitch next year at some point maybe Let's upgrade knob. Let's upgrade ball lightning. Yep. Do we buy another orb? No, I'm going to save some money. Uranus hurts. That's a new one. Um, Aiden says I'd likely have to switch the Patreon sub to a Twitch sub. Yeah, that's, see, that's the fucking problem. Uh, Joe Humbert says, was the movie Watch Along Date decided? It wasn't. I'll get on that. Uh, thank you for reminding me. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. Uranus Hertz has done a super sticker. It's of, uh, it's of a peach, uh, but it looks like a butt. This is very funny. Mummy, Watch Along. Get it organized. Pin message. Uh, Shell's a great and powerful AKP and Optimus on a super chat saying thanks Johnny for everything. You're all good. You're gonna get it done. You are. You just are, let's face it. Um But you know, you could get it done sooner. Sapper sack. All bombs are replaced with cherry bombs and deal two times damage to enemies. Yes, that sounds great. Yeah, we've only done one bloody watch along ever on this channel. We should really get on it. Dum dum. Bum bum. It's just, I think, basically, if they added raiding to YouTube, I'd fucking love it and I'd be all over that shit because I think it's so wholesome and so lovely. And the sense of community you get from streamers who know each other and check each other out and blah 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 is great. Is that enough for me to abandon YouTube? No. <laughs> just isn't. But, um, what is going on here with this flashing bullshit? I want to set off a bomb because they're going to do loads of damage. Well, that'll do. Bam! Well, I'll take out that guy's shield. Fucking wizard. I'm going to target that wizard with my Evisor bait. That's what I'm going to do. Right, okay. That's a bomb going off. Have some of that. Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, fuck it, let's heal. Should we upgrade an orb? No! I'm going to save our money for the shop. Who MD21 says Muppets Christmas Carol watch along? I'm sorry, I saved the Muppets Christmas Carol for the, the sing along that I attend in in real life with friends every year. I've seen the film so many times, I can only really watch it one festive period, once in the festive period each year. Otherwise, I, I would, but I, I can't. Oh, if we go chest, then we can go to the shop. All right, let's go let's try and go to the chest. Nailed it! Some guy sitting down has done a super chat saying, please don't leave for Twitch. So unfriendly to me. And also you hunting us for sport. Very funny. I'm not going not gonna to leave YouTube. I'm going to keep streaming on YouTube. Do not do not worry. Um, there's no chance of... Basically, if I started streaming on Twitch, it would be an as well as, not an instead of. And it's something I'm just idly thinking about every now and then. Because my partner watches a lot of Twitch streamers. And they just they just seem nice. There seem like some, I mean, obviously there are some chuds on there, but like the people my partner watches seem really nice and they seem to like know each other and sort of that kind of thing. It just seems pleasant. So heal six when reloading. Yes, we'll take a well done steak. All right. Let's go to the shop. Okay. Who MD21 says Muppets Treasure Island then? Yeah, I'd be up for that actually. Shall we remove an orb? Yeah, let's remove a peb ball. Now, do we replace it with anything? Not the angry tomahawk, I don't like it. Multi ball. I'm good for now, actually. Thank you for your insights, everybody. Those are very, very useful. Let's get this. Uh, you know what? I don't mind which way I go, so let's just boink. Mm. 
It's Big Boss. Arian says, speaking of people knowing each other, I've been watching a lot of Among Us VODs and those streams were so wholesome too. God, that was a time, wasn't it? Right, let's target the wizard with this. What a strange time that was. Among Us absolutely everywhere. Nobody able to meet up in person, which was a challenge when you're running a tabletop uh, website's YouTube channel. Fucking 0.5. Uh, but Among Us was really funny. I do really need to uh, try Lethal Company. I've got some friends who are really up for it, but one of them has been away for months and has only just come back. And, 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 and. Um, so, yeah, I really need to try it. And also, actually, all of the people that I want to try it with, I used to play GTFO with, and we've just started talking about it. We've been like, maybe we should go back to GTFO. So it's probably going to be... <laughs> probably going to be a while before I'm, I actually try Lethal Company. We'll see. I don't know. Anyway, thank you for tuning into just Johnny Thinks Out Loud about things. I hope I didn't startle anybody vis-a-vis, uh, -vis, you know, what if I stop appearing on YouTube, etc, etc. Obviously, I very much value the audience I have here, and it's taken time to build it. So I'm not going to do anything to jeopardise it. But, uh, it's just good to think about these things sometimes. Not jeopardizing things. I mean, trying other platforms. Because listen, let's put, I'll put it this way. It's much better me talking about this than being like, I think I'm going to st start doing comedy TikToks, everybody, because I'm too fucking old for that shit. And everyone would rightly hound me off TikTok. And hopefully the internet. I would deserve it. Cassandra Needham has done a super chat saying, Fun fact, any screening of The Muppets Christmas Carol can be a sing-along if you don't care about getting kicked out of the cinema. So true. I will say, my superpower uh, is... I... You know, like, when you've seen a film so many times, you remember the rhythm of it? I never, ever, ever miss. My timing is perfect on uh, Peter going, It smells so good, Mother! After uh, Miss Piggy tells him not to stop turning that spit. Uh, I do it every single time I go watch that film in the sing-along uh, and it always gets a giggle uh, which makes me happy it's it's good fun this run is oh, I jinxed it oh no this run is going suspiciously well Mr. Tom for the win says hey I'm on TikTok and I'm older than you mate you go for it I'm just mean me specifically like I I no puedo no puedo you're, I'm sure you're a bloody delight on TikTok. Let's upgrade something. Fuck it. Uh, yeah. Full ball walk. Yeah. It grants some ball walk. Deal extra damage along your orbs are in flight. Refresh shiv. <laughs> when enemy is, uh, whenever an enemy is defeated, refresh the board. I love that. That's great. I'll take that. This is feeling a, like a very, 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 very good run. Jay Appleseed says, are you still going? I'm normally catching up by now. Yes, I'm live for another seven minutes. Cat Astrophy says, I have TikTok, but I'm definitely not on TikTok. Yes, I watch TikTok. I actually delete it. I, I only reinstall it every now and then when I need sort of a brain cleanse, otherwise I watch it too much. But um, flying enemies are attacked horizontally, allowing for improved targeting. Grabby hand. No, 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 no grabby. You need nice hands. Nice hands, no grabby. Screenshot that. Uh, basic blade, we'll take that. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, I just watched some TikToks. I'm like, these are so fucking funny. If I tried to emulate this, I would show my whole ass. Nice hands, nice hands only. Hell yeah. Okie dokie. Um... Classics are classics for a reason. Oh, way! 168 damage. We, we love to see it. We really do. Weep. Come on, let's throw some bombs. I've said that an alarming number of times this stream, but hey ho. Missy Mary says it looks like it's time, coming to that time of evening for me to print up a chapter and get editing. Good on you. I hope it goes all right. I have some serious fucking editing work to do, and I've been putting it off. I haven't even opened my manuscript since the middle of October, and that's not all right. 
Oh, 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 this is such a, a lovely bomb run. Run. I really need to do some editing. Maybe that's what I'll do after dinner. We'll see. Uh, mm -mm -mm. Plus one spin faction. Let's get another ball lightning. Fuck it. Uh, let's heal. Let's. Why? 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 Why not? Why not? You know. Alex Greenhouse says, "Oh heck yeah, Peglin." This game has earned a lot of my time on my phone, jumping to the start, but very stoked to see you play it. I bloody love it. Snow Ninja Sandcat says, How play game? What purpose of game? Okie dokie. Um, Anna Axelson says, I'm literally doing some novel script editing as we speak. Bloody hell, good on you for managing to... I have to not ha I can have music on, but nothing else when I'm editing. Um, basically, uh, Snow Ninja Sandcat, this is a bit like Slay the Spire, but you attack enemies by playing Peggle. Uh, oh no... We need to... Alright, we'll offer it the ball lightning. <gasps> oh my god, my dag orb is now level 3. Fuck yeah. Um, you've caught me in kind of a middle bit. We need to do a fight next uh, to show you. James O'Sullivan is on Super Chat saying, 7 minutes, perfect. This has been fun. Thanks, Johnny, but need to do D&D &D prep. Converting Baldur's Gate 1 into 5e for friends who never played the original. That sounds bloody brilliant, James. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, but yeah, absolutely run away. Um, I, I hope the prep goes well, and I hope playing Baldur's Gate 1 in 5e for those people is a fucking delight. All right, cool. Uh, take a relic. Pebbles get no. All attacks get plus zero, plus one. Sure, we'll take the complex core. Um, let's have a let's have a hard fight. Fuck it, why not? So, this is the um. The combat bit. So you got enemies up here, and then these are the balls in the queue that I will throw. And you play, you play a peggle adjacent game. So I'm doing three damage, six damage, fifteen damage, eighteen damage, twenty, twenty, thirty-three. I'm also throwing a bomb, and they're powered up this run because of some relics that I have. This game's great. Please don't land in the 0.5. Yeah, times two damage. Boing. That was great. I enjoyed it very much. Right. I'll finish this fight, and then, uh, for better or worse, I will call it a day at the end of that. Um, because I got to—it's the dog's dinner time in two minutes, and if I'm late, she lets me know. Um. But this has been a really bloody lovely stream. I've enjoyed it very, very much. Um, I make no secret about the fact it's been a hard year and that the last few weeks haven't been easy either. But this has really properly cheered me up and it's been just a delight. And you're all lovely as per usual. So, um, yeah. Ooh. You know what? I won't start wrapping up the stream too soon because it doesn't feel like this, is wrap this fucking fight's going to end too soon. Come on, ball lightning. Yeah, ball lightning! Oh, ball lightning. Come on. I don't even care that you went in the 0.5. That's a couple of big bombs. Big batter booms. Boom. All right. Great, 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 great. Um, that game is fantastic. And I bloody love it. And thanks again to whoever it was who suggested it because holy shit. That was great fun. So, um, thanks everyone for tuning into the stream. I am not streaming on Thursday, unfortunately. Um... This week is quite intense. I'm actually getting tattooed on Thursday. Um, my bad. I I should have um, arranged it for not a Thursday, but there it goes. What Saturday, there will be a fresh episode of Press and Kiedini of uh, Sherlock Holmes The Awakened for everyone who uh, watches those as they come out on YouTube. Or if you're a patron, there's going to be a brand new season of Press and Kiedini starting. I am accepting suggestions for games right now. The vote will be up tomorrow. So we're going to pick the game very soon so I get a chance to record the episode and get it out on time. So do have a look at that. Um, talk of the Patreon. Uh, Patreon.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. There's a link in the description of this video and in chat if you are able and willing to support me directly through that. It really does make a difference. But also, it's just really lovely. All of you who tune in and, and, and watch and chat and super chat. Well, Thognalus has done a super chat saying, I love this game so much. I'm going to chuck another super chat in here. Thank you. That was very, very kind. Um, but basically, uh, you people keep the lights on in this place, and you you know it means that I can do this for a living, and it's um, really humbling and gratifying and lovely, and 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 and. and. So without getting too mushy, um, I will 
Uh, catch you soon. I will um, let you know when we're going to do a watch along on the mummy because that is such a good idea. Uh, and yeah, just generally speaking, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Have a lovely rest of your day, however much is left. And uh, no, that's it. Take care. Bye.